I guess I better load up Pleasant View. There we go. Loading up. Hello, guys. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. I hope you all had a great weekend, and I hope you're having a wonderful Monday. I'm ready to jump in and play some more Pleasant View. I think we have to finish college with Alexander and Tasha. I think they're just about done. Correct me if I'm wrong. God knows sometimes I forget what we did. <laughs> hey, everybody. Welcome, welcome. So here we are in Pleasant View and... Oh God, what am I doing? Let me, where's my college? Where's my college? There we go. I loaded Pleasant View again. I always, I always do that. I don't know why I do that. Oh my God, but look how pretty this looks. Look how pretty this is. I, what I'm gonna do is go through and delete all these low poly trees that are in the middle of the rest of the pretty trees. But that is a lot of work, so I'm not gonna do it now. <laughs> hey guys. Yes, I still have a kidney stone. And I've been having a little bit of pain off and on today, but I'm okay. I'm okay to stream for the moment. I'll let you guys know if I have to run away. <laughs> oh, thank you so much for the 200 bits, APK. Thank you. Hello, everybody. Okay, so right now I'm doing okay. Just in case anybody wants to know. <laughs> I'm doing okay. No, they are terrible. I've had about, this is my fifth one that I've had in my life. So I'm just really prone to getting them because I don't drink enough water. I think that's the reason why. And I drink a lot, I drink too much coffee and not enough water. So try to drink a lot of water today. It's possible I might have to stop for a pee break <laughs> because I've been chugging the water today. Thank you so much for the follow, Gelly. And I'm gonna do a hydrate now for Marta, thank you. I don't think I'll have to have surgery because this one hasn't even been bad enough for me to go to the hospital. And all the ones I've had before have been really tiny and they've passed on their own. I've never had like a real huge one before. So, and but even the tiniest little kidney stone is like, in, is the pain is just unbelievable. You guys, if you haven't ever had one, drink your water, okay? Everybody drink a lot of water. <laughs> From drinking too much monster energy, that doesn't surprise me. Oh, I got a bunch of hydrates. Okay, I'm glad to see you guys care so much. So I got one, two, three, four, five hydrates. All right, here we go. One. Two. <laughs> three. Four. And five. Woo! <laughs> We're playing the same music again, Miles. <laughs> oh, I got two more. Six and seven. All right, guys. Thanks so much. We're going to flush it out together. <laughs> One more. Oh, my God. All right. There we go. Oh, I got one more. This must be the last one. I might be out of hydrates now. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I used to always drink a lot of water because I know that I get kidney stones if I don't. But lately, I've been slacking off because I work a lot and then I just, like, forget to drink. So, I have to, like, set timers on my phone to remind me to drink to drink more. I always drink coffee in the morning. Sometimes I drink a little bit of tea and then I drink water. I don't really drink sodas or anything. Very rarely I'll have a diet soda, but not very often. Okay, thank you so much for the four, for thanking me for the 4K. <laughs> Or not thanking me, but congratulating me. Thank you. Yes, I have 4,000 followers on Twitch, and I'm so happy. Thanks to everybody who follows me. And, oh, I got another hydrate. I guess I'm not out. Oh, the Discord. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, I will ping the Discord. Thank you for reminding me. Let's let the Discord know we're going live here. And let me go ahead and load up college here, because I believe we are still in Sim State with Alexander and Tasha Go, of all people. I never thought he would end up with her. <laughs> but that's how things are going. And some people are just more prone to kidney stones than others. And I'm just one of those people that I get, I just have a lot of calcium, I guess. I just build up calcium easier than other people. I don't know. <laughs> okay, so let's see, let's see. That's the land grab house. So here is Alex and Tasha. I believe they are in their very last semester or pretty close to it. Oh my God, I forgot about Alexander's pants. I forgot about his whole outfit. He's just whole thing he's got going on. <laughs> 
Oh, I'm glad you made. I'm glad you could make it, Kristen. Alexander's gonna get ripped. And guess what, guys? We got new sound bites. I made a bunch of new sound bites today, so check those out if you got any extra bits floating around. You want to use some? I got ripped. I got find your pelvis. I got what else did I do? Hot drinks. I did a hot drinks. I did one more too. I don't remember what the other one was. Oh, how is Babby formed? <laughs> I got all those. Thank you. You like last podcast, MSK? That's my favorite podcast. I'm going to see them live. We saw them live once, and we're going to see them live again next year. Thank you for the follow, Fran. Thank you. <laughs> hey, cool cats and kittens. <laughs> Hot drinks really get you going by the way i found somebody who did a cover of hot drinks on acoustic guitar y'all and it was so good and i posted it in the discord go look in the discord under the music category i posted it this guy he only got a thousand views it was so good go give him some more views if you like hot drinks he did a great job <laughs> i might show it on the stream yay i'm glad you're here fran hey zoe <laughs> I, I know, I don't think drinks really get you going. You up when, when you feel you you're slow when, when these we always serve in Come on, find your pelvis. I know the spot and you don't have the movement. I love the pelvis playing a uh, playing against the hot drinks. Hot drinks pelvis. <laughs> that was perfect, guys. Thank you. That was a great way to start the stream. <laughs> Oh man, find your pelvis, hot pelvis. How is baby formed? How girl get pregnant? <laughs> oh man, that's hilarious. Yes, clip it, clip it mods, clip it. <laughs> oh, thank you so much for the follow, Oreo. Oreo Sarah. Oreos are yum. Yay, I figured it out. <laughs> hey, Zufrida. Oh yeah, we're gonna go crazy with the sounds. That's what they're there for, y'all. <laughs> okay, so let's see here. Tasha, oh my gosh, she looks so different with her hair down without those iconic pigtails, doesn't she? Tasha and Alex are in their junior year, so we don't have much time to go, and then we're gonna head back to Cassandra and Dawn and our little twins. <laughs> Get ripped. <laughs> that was me, that was my voice. All right, Get ripped. <laughs> <laughs> Melba pelvis no <laughs> oh my god Kristen I'm so sorry you had to have surgery for your kidney stones that sucks I never have had to have, have surgery mine have all passed on their own although sometimes if I get a, I had like one that was about I can't remember the size of it I'm so I want to say eight millimeters and they had to give me flow max to fl so I could just flush it out of me <laughs> That was the best one. Yeah, that was me. <laughs> thank you so much for the three months, Bodie. Thank you. And thank you for the follow, Clay Crossing. All right, here we go. Here we go, y'all. Let's see what's going on. So Alexander wants to give a backer up to Tasha, flirt with Tasha. Of course we want him to do that, but he needs a skill point. And, or he's not going to pass. So we got to work on this logic skill point for him. But right now he's sleeping. So let's just press play and let them get through the night um did they get i think they got engaged they did they got engaged last time we played pleasant view so they will probably end up getting married now we can hold our breath and we can hope that lucy is going to get back in the picture but i don't know guys i think alexander has fallen for tasha and forgot all about lucy <laughs> i know i'm gonna miss the spooky animations too i'm gonna have to find some turkey animations or something for next next month <laughs> Thank you for the follow. This is Rage. We can only hope Lucy comes to her senses, but I don't think she's going to. Oh, I forgot to tell you guys. We got eight inches of snow last night, by the way. Oh, thank you so much for the three months, Tristess. The three months at tier two. Thank you. Yeah, we got, we are, we're snowed in. We got like eight, ounce, eight inches of snow out there. It's like 17 degrees. Yep. You made a clip of hot pelvis. <laughs> Thank you, Marta. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God, these two. These two. Are they doing what I think they're doing? 
Did they just wake up in the morning for some morning time delight? Yep. I think Tosh is going to be prego, y'all. I really do. I really do. Now, somebody needs to play how is Babby formed. <laughs> Kiss romantically. All right. Let's keep our eye on these two. They're just doing a regular woohoo. Hot pelvis is clipped. <laughs> it was eight degrees where you are? Oh, boy. Oh, boy. We had a winter storm last night. Yesterday and last night. I was going to take a picture, but I didn't get around to it. Long, long, long man. man. Thank you so much for the three months, night crawlers. Thank you. A long, long pelvis. <laughs> oh boy. College Babby incoming. The good news is if she did get prego, mm -hmm. she probably wouldn't have the baby before she graduated. No, I don't think she would. If she got pregnant right now, we might have a baby like immediately before she moved out. <laughs> So, okay, are they done? Are they done? Come on, we gotta get on with our lives here, you two. Constantly woohooing, just constantly. <laughs> um, I don't do resurrections, Adam. I don't resurrect my Sims at all, so no. That's why I don't have a rule for it, because I just don't do it. Yep, APK, it surely does. <laughs> Colorado does have weather swings. Okay, so let's check out what we need to do. Let's take care of some needs here. Alexander, he needs to eat breakfast, get to the bathroom, and then he's going to work on his logic skill. He has to go to... He doesn't have to go to class till 6 p.m. We got time. Thank you so much for the Prime Sub hand boop. And Shannon wants to give a shout-out to the Mary Squad. Shout-out to the Marys. Thank you, guys. Thank you for all your help with the Discord and with the streams. I appreciate you guys so much. Okay, so let's see, Tasha. Oh my God, her, oh, she's prego, y'all. She's prego. She's pregnant. She's pregnant. Look at her comfort. She is, she is. Yep, yep. Oh, is she baby barfed? I didn't even see the baby barf either. I just saw her comfort go down and I was like, yep, I know she is. <laughs> Babby is How formed. How is Babby formed? How <laughs> girl get pregnant? <laughs> Yes, perfect timing. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> and thank you so much for the follow, April. And thank you for the two months, Lettykins. Okay. Oh, the letter. Okay. We are on... Uh, thank you, Han. We are on letter... Letter T. T as in... What's something that starts with a T? <laughs> T isn't something that starts with a T. T isn't Tasha. <laughs> T isn't Tasha. Um, that is the letter that we are on, I believe. We didn't have any T babies I didn't account for, did we, guys? I don't think so. I don't think so. I think we're on T. Turlet! How can I forget T for Turlet? <laughs> Thank you for the follow, B. Telma. Okay, guys, so put it. you can put in your name. Um... You can put in your names here for the letter T. Don't do Telba. Okay, just don't put in Telba. I know you think it's cute, but don't do it. Because my mods have to remove it. Because I'm not going to name my baby Telba. Thank you. And no Tamelba either. <laughs> <laughs> Fart right back at you. Okay, and uh, shout out from Marie to Cindy's way of saying, okay, that triggers your Google Assistant. I'm so sorry. I hope I don't accidentally, like, order something for you. <laughs> yes, all variations are banned. <laughs> okay, so we got to work on her uh, comfort here. That we, She doesn't have a bathtub or anything, so I'm hoping that lounging on the couch is going to get, it looks seems to be going up pretty fast here. And she needs to get a skill point in something. Body. She needs to get ripped. <laughs> but we can't do that yet. We got to get her comfort up. So that's what we're going to focus on for her. And then Alexander, like I said, he's about to go take a dump. He's going to go take his morning dumps. <laughs> if you have to ask if the name is appropriate, the answer is no. <laughs> Oh, T 
Taylor. Oh, we got Taylor. Okay, we did have a T. Never mind. Don't put your T names in. <laughs> I forgot about Taylor. Herb's baby Taylor. So that means we are on. If you've already submitted, don't worry. We can use those another time when we get to the letter T. So we're on V. V as in VD. <laughs> I don't know. V as in Victoria. We're on the letter V. I got to write down Taylor, y'all. My, my spreadsheet is behind, and I'm so sorry. So V as in Vavavoom. <laughs> as in Vidkind. No Velbas. No Velbas. Thank you. <laughs> V is in vid Turlba. Oh my God, no. Okay, so we're on the letter V. I am sorry, I forgot about Taylor. <clears throat> that is my bad. Poor little Taylor, already getting forgotten about. Poor little illegitimate Taylor. Van I like Vanessa. Vanessa's good. Violet, but put them in the spreadsheet, guys. Put them in the spreadsheet or in the uh, form. I'm sorry, not spreadsheet. Thank you for the prime sub, Cassaby. Oh, yep. Tasha just got the baby pukes. She sure did. Okay, her comfort is going down again, y'all. I'm really worried about this baby. Get down here and lounge. And we're gonna have to, she needs to get some food too. Oh, this is not good. She's in a bad, she's in a bad way here. She's in a bad way. Oh, and think, uh, there are some good V names that would be a good goth name. I think like something like Viola Goth sounds good. Or Violet, Vanessa. If there's two babbies, which I don't think there will be, but if there's two, then you can also, we are also on, what's the next letter? Hold on. Uh, w. W is the next letter after V. But I'm pretty sure we're only going to get one baby, I hope. Who knows? Sometimes they just throw twins at me. I feel like we've been having a lot of twins lately. Vincent's good too. Yeah, I have a Vincent broke in my original pleasant view. Look at this cafeteria worker letting the pancakes go bad. What's wrong with you? You're letting our food rot because there's not enough Sims here to eat it all. Um, okay, Alexander, he's ready to go. He's ready to go study chess. So let's have him go or study logic, I mean. No, don't turn on the radio. Um, let's see. <laughs> S Shanna gave a shout out to Cindy playing Among Us with the Mary Squad. <laughs> someday I will, guys. Someday I will. But usually you guys play right after I streamed, and then I have no more, like, social energy to give. You know what I mean? <laughs> so we got to do it on a day I don't stream. Um, thank you so much for giving out those two gift subs, Steph Always Sims. Thank you so much for giving a gift sub to... Uh, Steb and Tommy! Yay! <laughs> I will, guys. I will play with you sometime, but it, like I said, after three hours of streaming, I can't talk anymore. I'm dead. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> three hours is good, right, Mary? You got four times, twins four times in a row? Oh my god. I have no idea what that means, Blue Chicken. I don't know what... I, I've never played Among Us before. I don't even know how to play it. <laughs> they sh Oh, the yeah. Please only put one name in, your, in the form, guys, okay? Please only put one name in the form or it might screw up our formula. Okay, I am really worried about Tasha, y'all. She is not doing good. We, we don't have a bathtub for her to take a bath in. Oh, boy. I'm going to see if we can get her to come watch a movie or something. Maybe get her comfort up while she... Not children! Not children's movie. One boy name, one girl name. That's what you can submit. Don't put multiple in there. Yeah, people usually want to play in the Discord. We have a voice channel in there if anybody wants to use it to play. You're welcome to. Okay, please, Tasha, please get your comfort up, honey. Really worried about her. And she needs to work. There's no way she's going to be able to get her body skill. But that's okay, because she's already going to pass this semester. And like I said, I think we're going to have a babby right before they go home and graduate. Because we have, we had like... 
26 hours until final exam and then they have another 48 hours until they graduate. Hmm, maybe we could do a stream of it. I was thinking about that. You know what we could do, guys? Is we could do a stream of Among Us. I don't know if I want to do that. I don't know if I want to go down that road. <laughs> if I did, I would do it like an extra stream. I wouldn't like take the place of our sim streams. She can, yes, but I'm also trying to get her fun up. She can nap in here, but I'm also trying to get her fun up. Okay, she's done watching the movie, so let's have her nap in here and see if that helps. That's a good idea. That's a good idea. Okay, her comfort's going up, so hopefully that'll that'll work. And she doesn't wake up and her comfort go down again. No, she has class in an hour. Sorry, Tasha, you can't go to class today. She can't go. She's missing class. <laughs> oh that's true Hendrick that's true you couldn't play and moderate could you <laughs> that's true maybe we could have a couple people maybe you guys could switch out or something how many people do you need to play uh, among us is it just like any amount of people or do you have to have a certain amount tell me more tell me about your ways <laughs> four to ten okay we could probably figure something out we'll see yeah that's true she could do her assignment we could have her do her assignment to make up for it i'm just i'm happy we're getting her comfort up whoever thought of putting her in the chair that's a good idea okay alex here he's doing great yes okay so what does he want to do complete junior year go to class write term paper um He's going to class tonight and that should get him an up enough to to pass. So I'm not going to worry about having him do a term paper right now. I know Among Us is people are talking about it everywhere. It's it's hot. It's hot to trot right now. <laughs> oh, and thank you for helping me reach my sub goal too. Thank you guys so much for everybody who subscribed. Um okay, Tasha, I'm keeping a close eye on you. Real close. Alexander's over there just going crazy on the skill points. I'm just going to let him keep going if that's what he wants to do. <laughs> yeah, I could do that, Morgan Morganic. I definitely could. I will let me think on this guys and see how I want to see how I want to do it here. He's getting ripped. He's getting ripped on logic. <laughs> Yeah, I wouldn't want to play in a, in a public server either. I would want to play in a private server with just, like, some of you guys. Oh, yeah, she's prego. She's prego. She's prego big time. Not just a little bit pregnant. She's all the way. <laughs> I'm just trying, trying to get her comfort up. Okay, let's get her up and get her to a shower and get her some food. And then we'll have her watch another movie for fun. She ha she couldn't go to class today because she was just she's having a really hard time with this pregnancy. You know, some Sims it just feels like it's easier to keep them to keep their needs up than others. But Tasha's having a real hard time. Okay, Alexander's got to go to class. Alex, you got to get off of that chess table and go to class. One of you has to go at least. <laughs> Okay, come on, come on, Tasha, come on. No, 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 don't go turn the radio on. I know you want fun, you need to eat. You need to eat, eat your eat your macaroni. Come on, you can do it. She's thinking about that woohoo. She's thinking about woohooing with Alexander. Her outfit choice is really something, y'all. Her red, but don't, why are you eating outside in the snow? Ugh. This dorm, I'm gonna, I need to do some work on this dorm. I, I think I'll take these tables out um, because they, I don't like it when they go out here and eat. She's thinking about her engagement to Alex. Aw, they're going to be so sweet together. I guess, I guess Lucy is definitely out of the picture now. No, I don't just eat my mac and cheese out in the freezing snow. <laughs> I mean, I guess I could go out there and eat my dinner tonight in the snow, I, but I won't. <laughs> I know, it could have been me. <laughs> yeah, Lucy's going to have her own babies. She's going to have a lot of babies. We might try, we're going we're gonna to try to do 10 babies with Lucy. 
What do you guys think? I know she's going to roll the one. I know she is. Um, no, I don't think Lucy's pregnant yet. We're just saying, we're just planning. We're planning, Joe. <laughs> Lucy is with uh, Orlando. Is it, wasn't it Orlando? Yeah. Ten kids and counting. That's what I'm going to name the episode, too. <laughs> okay, come on. Uh, but Tasha is prego. Tasha is prego. We're trying to really keep an eye on her. Because she was having a rough time. Get over here and go to the bathroom. And she, you are not answering the phone. No, you are not answering the phone. I'm trying to suffer. I've never done it before. I've never done the 10 babies. So I think Lucy would be the perfect sim to do it with, especially since we're making her into a fundy sim. <laughs> yep. Yep. They're two family sims. I do not want to play the 100 baby challenge show. 10 baby challenge. That's as far as I'm going. 10 babies. <laughs> yeah, we're going to give her the fertility treatment, too. Oh, I don't know if I said thank you, but thank you for the follow, Bridgie. I don't remember if I thanked you for that. Who is she talking to? We got to make sure she doesn't keel over. She's talk talking to Goopy Gills Carbo. <laughs> Mary Sue and Alexander. Oh, no. That's weird. That's weird. Okay, go watch, go watch a movie again. Go watch a funny movie. Watch a comedy. She hasn't even been able to work on her body skill because it's just, I'm just trying to keep her needs up. There are four Sims in your neighborhood going for 10? Oh boy. I've never ever done, I don't think I've ever done more, had more than six kids. And that was with the burbs. That was with John and Jennifer that I had six kids. And that, I think that's the most I've ever had. Oh boy. 10 kids is just, it's going to be rough. It's going to be rough. Oh yeah, you can adopt too. That's true. That's true. You can. Um, I don't remember, Joe. I don't remember what, how many bolts Lucy and Alexander had in my game. I don't remember. But, um, Alex and Tasha only have one bolt too, but they decided to get engaged. They didn't care. <laughs> goopy appreciation <laughs> <coughs> i honestly don't really play the expansion pack neighborhoods that much okay let's send her to bed let's send her to bed she's gonna be hungry but she needs to sleep and alex is oh alex is out here making a snowman i don't play them that often really but i i like um I probably like Desiderata Valley the best, even though it's got the worst builds in the entire Sims series, in my opinion. <laughs> yeah, uh, Lucy and Orlando are definitely getting a fertility treatment. Okay, Alex, you need to come inside, honey. You need to come inside. Let's get some macaroni before the cafeteria worker leaves. Get some macaroni. Let's get him to the bathroom, to the shower, and get him to bed. And let's, let's make sure, yeah, he's going to pass. He's going to pass with at least probably like a C plus. And Tasha is also going to pass. So that's all we care about. Their final exams are in 12 hours. Oh, we got two shout outs. Okay, I got a shout out from Bridgie. Shout out to The Sims 3 that just gave you error code 12 after, four, after playing for two hours and forced close without saving. Oh, no. Oh, God, no. That's why I have, for The Sims 3, I have a uh, autosave. I have an autosave mod um, and I sometimes I ignore the autosave but most of the time I use it <laughs> and shout out from Nick to me aw for piquing your interest in the Sims 1 again oh you installed it today oh that's so cool it's fun it's fun to play around with I can't ever play it for like I can't get like super into it like I do in the Sims 2 but I can play it for a couple hours every once in a while and it's fun it's got, there's so much to explore and do. There really is. I know there's an autosave for Sims 2, but I don't use it. Because I'm, like, really good about saving my Sims 2, and I hardly ever have crashes. Now I say that, it'll probably crash on me. <laughs> okay, come on, come on. Hurry up and eat your macaroni. You're boring, as Alexander. You're so boring. You're so boring. Okay, let's get him to the bathroom. Get him to the shower and get him to bed. And then he's got he's got to get plenty of rest. 
for his uh, exam tomorrow. All right, let's go. Let's get it on. <laughs> you like the Sims 1 video? Good, I'm glad. It was really fun to make. I was just feeling like, God, I don't know what video I feel like making. And I was like, you know what? Let's just play Sims 1. I was going to play Sims 1. <laughs> Do you hate the way Alex looks? Oh, I, th I, I find him charming. I find him charming. <laughs> yeah, Tosh will probably get tired of him. I don't know. She's a family sim, and I think as long as he keeps putting babies in her, she's going to be happy. <laughs> as long as she keeps getting those babies, she doesn't care. And he's going to be working all the time. Aw, thanks, Sammy. Shout out to me for letting you make emotes. Well, I should do a shout out to you for making the emotes. Thank you. Oh, I got to save from Shauna. Okay, let me save. I love those emotes. I can't wait till we could use them. Hopefully soon I will hear back. <laughs> All right, let's go back to live mode. Let's speed this up. We've got eight hours until final exam now. <clears throat> Sims 1 babies. <laughs> I don't know. I never really played with the babies very often, but they turn into children after like three days. Okay, we've got five hours. Five hours left. Five long, boring hours. Okay, here we go. They're waking up now. Tasha, okay, she's doing good. She got her comfort up as pretty much as high as we can get it. So what are you doing now? You're just walking with no purpose. She has no purpose. Where are you going? Where are you going? Okay, she's just gonna walk in here and stand. That's that's a good idea. Um, let's go ahead and get you taken care of for the day. Get you some breakfast. What are we having today? Omelets, all right. You, I don't think Alex has the broken face template. I don't think so. Mm -mm. I don't think he does. I really don't. I don't... Uh, no, I don't think so. I mean, his face looks a little broken, but <laughs> I don't think it's from the broken face template. <laughs> okay, I really want to have Tasha work on her body skill if I can, but I'm, we also have to keep an eye on that comfort. Um... And then, I don't know, next semester, she might not make it through her senior year. She might not make it. She needs three body skill, and then I don't know what else she's going to need beyond that. We'll see. We'll see. The broken one looks like face two at other ages. Yeah. Yeah, it's, he doesn't, he's not properly genetic. That's true. But it's not the broken one. But anyway, I have the broken one fixed in my game. But he still doesn't have it. Okay, you're really going to eat your omelet outside in the freaking cold again? Come on, come on. Hurry up. Do something interesting. <laughs> so she should be getting her baby bump today or tonight, I think. Let's go turn on the radio. Oh, no, she's got to go. Never mind. She's got to go. I know you feel terrible, but you got to go take your final exam. Oh, her comfort just went down a lot, too. This mod makes it difficult, the miscarriage mod, because every time they get the little pregnancy thought bubble above their head, they lose, like, half their comfort. Yeah, I'm sure that that's what they did, Joe. I'm sure that's what they did. They just made him and created him. I think they did the same thing with the Pleasant Twins. Um, thank you so much for the two-month sub, Erin. Thank you. And thank you for the follow, Ard Arduin. I don't know if I said that right. I'm sorry. <laughs> I wish I would have... Um, gone in and made my Sims genetic. Oh my god, what happened? Oh, oh, oh. She's getting baby bump. She's getting a baby bump. Oh, and now she wants to have a baby. Well, good, because you're having one. <laughs> There's our baby bump. So I don't know. It's 11 o'clock right now. So at the latest, we're definitely going to have a baby before they leave. That's, that's all I'm saying. We're definitely going to have a baby before they leave. If they graduate first, we'll just keep them here until the baby's born. 
Okay, so they both got 500 simoleons. Let's go divide those up and let's get Tasha to do hers first. I haven't had a single Sim die in childbirth yet. And I've had this mod in for quite a while and I haven't had any Sims die yet. And now I'm going to jinx myself. Now I'm going to jinx myself. Let's see. Bank online, deposit, 500. We'll get her to do hers first. And oh, look, Alexander wants to graduate. Okay, yes, we're gonna make sure he graduates. Tasha doesn't care about graduating. She just wants to have her baby. It has multiple names with all the letters except Y. I don't use Y, so that's good. <laughs> I also don't use X and Z. <laughs> I know, I know. Yeah, that was really sad what happened to Leslie, but good thing she didn't die. <laughs> yeah, I think getting the baby bump does make them generate the have a baby want. If they're family sims, sims at least. Okay, so now she needs comfort. I'm going to have her go watch a movie again. This time she's going to watch an action movie. And then Alexander, he's doing great. We just need to get him some skills. So he needs logic and cleaning. So we'll have him go and uh, practice chess to get his logic skill up. We're going to get him to graduate. Oh, he wants to make Dean's list and graduate. Well, we're going to try, Alex. We will try our best for you. <laughs> yeah, I know, Mary. At least it'll be a townie. <laughs> At least it'll be a townie. Although she's not going to be a townie for long. We're going to marry her in, hopefully. That would be so tragic if she died and then Alex had to go back to Lucy for comfort. <laughs> Townie lives matter, that's right. <laughs> do not suggest Elba's. Are people still suggesting Elba names? Don't do the Elba's, guys. Um, It's a mod. Bank Online is a mod. It's Monique's hacked computer. Okay, so Alex is going to town on his logic skill, and Tasha, she's doing all right. She's lounging. Let's have her take a little nap in the chair again for comfort. That seemed to get her comfort up pretty fast last time. Okay, good for you, Alex. And now they have to go to class. Now they have to go to class. Let's see if Tasha can go today. I think she can go today. I think she can go. I would really like her to graduate, but she's not going to be able to graduate if we can't get her another skill point. One charisma skill point would get her to graduation. And she wants to gain a skill point, so we will try to do that. I'm keeping the skill point because to me that's more important than the have baby want. She'll probably roll the have a baby want again. Um, I don't know, Joe. I was just wondering that same thing, too. If the die in childbirth mod, if their needs have to be low or if it's random. I don't know. If anybody knows, please let us know. Okay, so let's see. Tasha, you we need to take care of you. She still has her have baby want. So go eat some chili. Some chili on a snowy day. That sounds good, doesn't it? Oh, it's random? Oh, yeah, I think I actually, now that you say that, I think I remember reading whenever I downloaded it, that there's like a, a it's a percentage. So there's like a 10% chance for everybody and you can tune the percentage. I, I believe that's right, Joe. Yeah. What letter what? What letter are we on? We're on letter V. V as in Vidkind. V is in victorious. Yeah, base 10% chance, and then the chance increases by 1% each day, beginning from when they reach 14 days away from Elder. Okay. I knew it was something like that. Thank you. Okay, who's calling? Who's calling, and what do you want? Alex answered the phone, I guess. Probably Goopy again. What is Goopy doing calling our college students? I don't know. <laughs> we don't need any Victorias or Victors, guys. We got enough. We got enough. <laughs> Zelda would be cute. It would be. But I'm not using Z. Uh -huh. 
It is cute. Yeah. Ooh, Vera is good. I like Vera too. So cool. The reason I don't I do hurricane naming naming conventions because there just aren't enough names with like XYZ. Um because I have a lot of babies. I got a lot of babies. Oh, he's friends with Ivy Coper. Who knew? He still he still has a crush on Lucy. He, she's still his first love. He'll never get over her, guys. But he now he has two bolts with Lucy and Tasha. So I don't know what happened, but he's got two bolts with him now, and he's got one bolt with Dina. That's so creepy. Okay, Alex, let's start working on your skills. You got the skills to pay the bills. You need to take a shower first. Wash the stank off ya. Yeah, 10%, it's st it is still pretty high, but I haven't ever had a sim succumb to it yet. Not yet. I'm sure it's coming. The time is coming. Oh my god, Tasha. You're so bad at taking care of yourself. Use the bathroom and go to sleep. She has no fun. This is like the roughest pregnancy I've had in a while. It's, n it has, it's not easy on her. And we still have 38 hours. Oh god gonna speed things up here okay alex you don't have time for tv if you want to make the dean's list buddy uh we got to get you a cleaning skill point so get in here to the study room and let's study cleaning <laughs> yeah the time will come the time will come i'm kind of i'm gonna be sad i'm gonna be sad whoever it is Aw, uh, Valentino is cute. Yeah, I like that. No, I, we were not we're not on tea. I forgot about baby Taylor. I forgot about little Taylor, which is Herb's baby. Because I didn't put him in the spreadsheet. I forgot about him already. <laughs> okay, come on. Get your get your study on. Look at him go. Look at him go. He's speed reading. <laughs> yeah, I forgot about Taylor. Oh, he got his cleaning skill point. All right. So I think that's going to give him the opportunity to get on the Dean's list. He's trying to do one last push before he graduates, but he's getting pretty tired now. It's almost 1 a.m. So I'm going to send him to bed and he'll study some more tomorrow. Let's go, Alex. Get yourself to bed. Get your boring self to bed. <laughs> oh, and let me save too. I'm really, I have trained myself over the years to save every time my Sims go to bed. But sometimes if you got if you have a crazy household where not everybody goes to bed at night, like you have some people awake and some people asleep, then sometimes I will forget to do it. But I have trained myself if everybody's in bed, it's time to save. <laughs> Ooh, I like Vivian too. That's cute. There's a lot of good V names. There are a lot of good V names. Ooh, all right, getting that interest on our bank accounts. Tasha, what'd you run off for? Okay, she needs to have fun. All right, whatever. Go ahead and have some fun. Is he going to congratulate her? Oh my God, does he even know she's pregnant? I mean, he saw her get the baby bump, so I guess so. Aw, uh, thank you so much for the follow. Dandy, Dandy D, thank you. Okay, come here. Come here, he's trying to congratulate. Oh, he's trying to tell you a dirty joke. <gasps> but I want him to rub belly. Not you, you. I want you to rub belly. Talk to Belle. Talk to the Belle. <laughs> Virginia. <laughs> That's good. I like that. Bobby Joe. <laughs> Talk to your babby, Alexander. Oh, he wants to be best friends. BFFs. He wants to be BFFs with Ivy. Wow, they're getting pretty tight. Okay, so Alex, you're done here. What do we need to do for you? Um, let's take care of his needs and then have him start working on that Dean's list again. This is the, which one's the man, men's? This one. Go get yourself some pancakes. Yum, yum. And Tasha, oh, Lord have mercy. Girl, you are not taking care of yourself. Use the bathroom, take a shower, get some pancakes. Whew, what time is her class? She has class at three to five and Alex, okay, they both have class at three to five. So we have some time. We have some time to work with. Ooh, I like Venus too. Let me ask you guys this. 
today I was playing The Sims 4 because I was making a video and I heard Sims 2 music in The Sims 4. I think it was coming out of the radio. Is that a thing or have I lost my mind? I swear I heard Sims 2 music coming out of the radio. <laughs> oh, it's the retro station. Okay, that's awesome. <laughs> that's awesome. I was like, wait, is that Sims 2 music? I love it. I love it. I'm going to just play. I'm just going to play that station constantly when I'm playing Sims 4. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, do that, Joe. Play, try it out next time. Uh, thank you so much for the follow, Simsy Angel. Because I don't ever check. I rarely ever check the radio station in The Sims 4. Like, I just let my Sims listen to whatever they want to. And somebody turned it on, and I was zoomed in really close. And I was like, that is Sims 2 music. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I'm going to be listening to that the whole time I'm in there. <laughs> I, do, I love The Sims 4 music, too, though. Not necessarily the radio music, but just, you know, the game music. Okay, Tasha, what are you up to? Going to eat your breakfast. Alex is such a slob. He's just shoveling it in. Away, not right on time. Dang it, I'm gonna get the lyrics one day. <laughs> oh, yay! I'm glad, Simsy Angel. I'm glad you're enjoying The Sims 3. It can be really fun. Um, I haven't played, I haven't been playing The Sims 3 that much lately, but I want to get back to it because I still want to keep working on my neighborhood there. I just, I get in the mood for different games. I just, I play all the, all the Sims games one through four. I play all of them. And it just depends on what mood I'm in. <laughs> I'm pretty much always in the mood for Sims 2 and the other ones, I, my mood fluctuates for them. <laughs> hot drinks in honor of your hot cocoa. Okay, Tasha, finish your eating, finish your eating and let's try to get you, I wish there was some way to get charisma that wasn't mirror. Can she study it on here? I think she can study it on here. Let's see, where is it, where is it? Um, is it under school? Study skills. Charisma. That way she can sit down and still get some comfort. <laughs> You're gonna spend all your bits on that clip. I know it's, I can't believe I haven't done that before. We needed that clip. <laughs> your strange town ended up all related. Yeah, it happens. It happens to the best of us. Okay, Alex, you're wasting my, oh, who didn't put, who didn't deposit their money? Alex? Ah, crap, she's on the computer now. Oh, well. Oh, well, you need, you don't have time for video games. You're trying to get on the Dean's list and look at that pathetic, look at that pathetic uh, progress you've made there. Influence someone to write your term paper, influence someone to do your assignment. Well, unfortunately, because I am an idiot, there's nobody else here to, co to convince. <laughs> so you're going to have to do your own assignments, buddy. All right, do your own assignments. Someday I'm gonna get those townies back in here. I hope before we get back to college, I'll get are the dormies. I hope before we get back to college, the next time I'll have some dormies in here, guys. Or maybe we'll do a we'll do an extra special creating dormies stream or something. Okay, we got baby bump number two. Ooh, baby bump number two on the way. There we go. All right, now are you still studying charisma? You get back there and study. Do what you gotta do. You gotta get through school, okay? W being pregnant. Charisma. One charisma skill is all you need to graduate. Come on now. Oh, she did she paint that? Aw, I'm gonna put that in her inventory. She doesn't need the four simoleons. I'd rather she had the painting. She can hang that in the baby's room. She is Gargante! <laughs> I know, same stub. Look at that pathetic progress you've made. <laughs> Can the cafeteria worker do the assignments? <laughs> hey, cafeteria worker. Alex would have to be really convincing to convince the old lady cafeteria worker to do his assignments. <laughs> oh god, Nightcrawler. <laughs> it's, so, it's so funny yet so sad. <laughs> Oh, I, I want...
want some if somebody wants to i want a meme i want a meme time because i saw a hilarious meme it made me literally laugh out loud y'all and it sammy submitted it and it was so funny <laughs> such a funny meme i'm like i'm showing that one first thing next time we get a meme time all right thanks zoe <laughs> okay let's do a meme time we got two we got two let me say I'm gonna show you guys this hilarious meme that made me laugh so hard. <laughs> yes, it's so funny. I'm cackling. I'm cackling at it. Hold on. I had it pulled up here. Okay, here it is. <laughs> it just, it kills me. It kills me. I wants them Aggies, mother. <laughs> It's the words. It's the words and the pictures. <laughs> I want them Eggies, mother. <laughs> the Sims 3 had the best glitches. It had the best glitches, I swear. <laughs> Demon baby. <laughs> Clip it. I want them Eggies, mother. <laughs> it looks like a creepy doll. I loved it. I loved that one. Thank you, Sammy, for that one. Okay, that one looks a little bit long. Um, oh, and then here's this one from Pomlaz. Don't know if I'm saying that right. Sorry. Um, Mom, why don't you play with the neighbor's kid? The neighbor's kid. What is wrong with the Sim? Somebody tell me. Does it have meat on its neck? <laughs> is that... Is that... Is that a scarf made of meat? Is that a scarf made of bacon? Somebody tell me what this means. <laughs> I don't know what this is. <laughs> I don't know what that is. That's hilarious. Thank you for thank you for those memes, guys. Keep the good memes coming. Okay, we got a commercial break. So I'm gonna look and see what we've got for commercials. And I'm gonna see. Um, if we have any that my mods have looked at yet first, first of all, I've been watching ones that haven't been, haven't been vetted by my mods, but I don't think they've gotten down to the ones at the bottom yet. So I, I'm just going to have to guess. And that's okay. That's okay. You guys do do this on at your own leisure. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and only if you want to. Um, let's see. We've got... Oh my god, that looks so creepy. These toys you guys are submitting look so creepy. We got another flex tape. Didn't we did we watch that one? Are there more than one flex tape? Oh, that's flex paste. There's flex paste and there's flex tape. And then I don't know what that is. Um okay, let's watch flex tape because I know this is going to be safe. <laughs> The meat hair girl. Oh, I wanted to show you guys the other cold, the hot drinks thing too. But let's watch, let's watch the flex. Let's watch the flex tape and then I'll work my way down from there. I think most of these look good though. They're like toys and stuff. Although the one toy commercial really did catch us off guard there. <laughs> All right, here we go. Flex tape commercial. Oh, let me make sure you guys can see it this time. I'm thinking of you. Here we go. The flex, right, Leah? <laughs> Hi, Phil Swift here for Flex Tape. Hey, the Phil. super strong waterproof tape. Oh, I need to make a clip of him too. That can instantly patch, bond, seal, and repair. Look at flex his tape face. Is no ordinary tape. It's triple oh, thick adhesive. That's virtually amazing. Welds itself to the surface. Instantly He's selling me. The He's selling leads. me. I want all Leaky the flex pipes products. Leaky can cause major damage, but flex tape grips on oh. tight and bonds instantly. Plus, I want flex it. tape's powerful <laughs> adhesive is so strong. It is the meme guy, yeah. It even works underwater. Now you can repair it leaks and pools water. and spas without draining them. Flex tape is perfect for marine. You can fit your, and RVs. fix your boat Flex seats. Flex tape is super strong. And once it's you can on, pick up weights. it holds on tight. And for emergency auto repair, Flex auto tape repair. keeps its grip what can even it in not, the what can't conditions. It do? What can't it do? Big storms can cause big damage. <laughs> but Flex tape comes super wide. You don't so do you your roof with that. Don't do your holes. roof. To show Don't you do your the roof. power of flex tape, 
He's got nothing on Billy Mays. <gasps> he just sawed that I in saw half. I sawed this boat in half and repaired it <laughs> with only flex tape. Not only does flex tape enough. powerful adhesive hold the boat together. Uh, there's but no way in hell I'm going out in that boat. Seal. So the inside okay, is I just got. I just dry. got. Just, just imagine this scenario. You go over to your friend's house. You're supposed to have a nice day out on the ocean in the boat. And your friend's like, yeah, I sawed my boat in half, but I taped it back up with flex tape. Let's go. <laughs> There's like, no, thank you. I'm going home. You go ahead and go out in your flex tape boat. <laughs> just cut, peel, stick and seal. Imagine oh. everything you can do. I like the, the other flex, flex better. Tape. I like the other Flex product better. What was the other one? Paste. The paste. I want that paste. <laughs> Thank you for sharing that commercial. Oh, that one was from Sammy, too. Thank you. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, oh, Iron Brew. Oh, we need to watch Iron Brew. Okay, this is where I'm at. I can't watch that one. Um, I, have, I don't know what that is. Something about Legos. We need to watch Iron Brew, though. But also, guys, go into music. Listen to this. Listen to this, okay? I'm not going to play it because it's like three minutes long. But listen to Quarantine Covers, Hot Drinks, Wendy's Training Video. This guy, he nails it, all right? He nails it. Give him some views. <laughs> okay, thanks, everybody, for the memes and the commercials. Um, I'm sure we'll have some more before the end of the stream. All he fixes are boats. That's all he fixes are boats, Deb. <laughs> Boats and giant plastic containers filled with water. If you have any of those that need to be repaired, you just get yourself some flex tape. <laughs> okay, Tasha. Oh, Tasha, good for you. Good for you. Oh, look, now she wants to... Oh, yes, now she wants to graduate and have a baby. Okay, we can do that. We can do that. She's definitely going to graduate. Um, she needs fun, though, so stop that go what are you, what even is her hobby what is her hobby because i've just been having her watch tv it's nature okay what can we do for nature um go i haven't rolled for her sub hobby yet i'm just gonna have her try out different stuff go go bird watching <laughs> don't be a lucy be lucy be a tasha <laughs> get yourself a flex boat <laughs> You're welcome. You're welcome for that <laughs> advice. His house held together with tape and flex paste. He built his whole house with flex paste and concrete blocks. <laughs> Can it fix Daniel, Mary Sue and Daniel's relationship? <laughs> just slap some flex paste on it. It'll be fine. Oops. I don't know why I just went off into the distance like that. Alex is in here. Alex, that is not what you should be doing. You do not need creativity skill points. What is wrong with you? Go do another assignment. Do assignment. I don't know why I'm so, like, averse to having them do uh, term papers. I know. The distance is pretty, isn't it? It's so beautiful. It's beautiful. Look at all those wintry trees. Lost all their leaves. Now they're just sticks. Okay, we gotta keep our eye on her. She's not having very much fun bird watching. That doesn't give you very much fun at all. Okay, um, do we dare have her watch clouds? Yeah, why not? Go watch clouds. <laughs> it fixed a whole boat, oh my God. Um, let's hope she doesn't get struck by a satellite. But hey, she's having fun. Have, I even have a mod that makes it more likely for them to get struck. Oh, no. She's got to go to class now. <laughs> she's got to go to class. She didn't get hit. She didn't get hit by a satellite. No, he didn't deposit his money yet. I need to have him do that, but he's going to class now. We'll get to see. Like, that should get his, his performance up above a C, at least, from going to class. I don't really know how much it gives them. I probably should pay attention to that. We'll just flex taper together. <laughs> oh, yeah, you won't get it off anything. That's true. You put flex tape on, it's on there forever. You're just going to have everything in your house going to be duct taped together. <laughs> All right. Good night, Marta. Some big have a good night. Monster that's always thinking about food. <laughs> we got to watch.
watch the dating videos again. Okay, let's check on Tasha. Oh, God. She's got to go to the bathroom and immediately go to sleep. That's all we can do for her. Wait, is that one ladies? This one's ladies. I can never remember. And then she's got to immediately go to sleep. Let's see. She's definitely going to graduate, though. So we, we managed that. We managed to squeak that out. Yeah, I have cloud watching. Nick, I do. Yeah. I just haven't rolled for her secondary hobby yet. I'll do it when we get her out of here. <laughs> I broke my arm. Have some flex tape. <laughs> wow. You bought a jug of water with a, the taped handle on it. <laughs> Clown watching. <laughs> What's your hobby? Clown watching. Look, Dina is calling Alexander to talk to him at college and see how he's doing. Aw, that's so nice. And they're best friends now. But I hope she doesn't have any other, anything else on her mind. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Your pathetic progress. <laughs> I, need to, I need to make a sound bite of pathetic progress. She's, she's super extreme, a pregante. Oh, he's rich. Look at her waddling back there. Alex is rich. He's going to get his his share of the goth fortune when he gets out of college. I usually give him like 50,000 simoleons from Cassandra so he can buy a house. All right, she's going to sleep now. Thank goodness she's about to pass out. Got to keep an eye on her hunger. And Alex is just talking to Dina. Talking to Dina on the phone. We've got 15 hours until final exam. Yay! And then we're going to have the baby. We're gonna have we're gonna have a graduation. Can think of the word graduation, and then we're gonna have a baby. Ah, thank you so much for the two months at tier two, Melon. Thank you. Oh yeah, I forgot. You guys have daylight daylight savings over there, somewhere in some places. When is I, when is daylight savings for me? That's what I want to know. Hold on, daylight. Daylight say I hope I didn't miss it. No, I didn't. November first. Oh, so it's coming up. We're gonna have daylight savings next week, next Sunday. So then I don't know. I think we'll be back on the same schedule. How is Babby formed? How girl get pregnant? <laughs> How is Babby formed? <laughs> thank you, Sam. Uh, thank you for the follow, Kinsey. Thank you, thank you. Um, I may actually give him a third of the money. I don't know. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna wait and see. I don't know how much of the money they have right now. You go first weekend in October. We go n in November. I didn't even know until you guys were telling me this that different places had different daylight savings times. Like I thought it was just the whole world was on the same time. I had no idea. It was different in different places. I'm ignorant. Hey, Alexander, is Tasha available to talk? No, 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 she's not. She's sleeping and she's pregnant. Don't call my girlfriend again. <laughs> All right, Alex, um, you need to get in the shower. Get in the shower. Oh yeah, there's gonna be a full moon on Halloween. Oh, we, Mr. Pleasant and I started watching a spooky show, y'all. Have you guys ever watched Castle Rock? I think it's on Hulu. Oh my God, it's so good. Well, we watched the first, uh, the first season of it like a year ago, and we just started watching the second season. And it is so good. Oh, it's it's spooky and creepy, but not like gory. It's like more like psychological thriller. It's it's good. You should finish it, Em. It's so, the second season is good, and I was really turned off because I was... Oh, my God, this phone. This phone is driving me crazy. I was really turned off because each season is like a different story. It doesn't continue the story from the previous season, and I hate shows like that. I hate shows like that because then I get attached to the characters, and then the next season is completely new characters. But anyway, so Mr. Pleasant was like, well, let's give it a try. So I was like, whatever. It's your turn to pick the show. So we started watching it and I got hooked on it. It's so good. <laughs> I th you, you thought so too, darling. I know. I didn't even know that. 
Yeah, it's in the Stephen King universe. Yes. In season two, it's the young Annie Wilkes. Hey, Alexander, is Tasha available to talk? No. No. St why are all these guys calling Tasha? Like, she's pregnant. Leave her alone. <laughs> We, I don't like daylight savings and I wish it would go away. We don't even need it anymore. At least not in the U.S. I don't know if people need it other places, but we don't need it here. Um, actually, two, I think two of our states don't even do it at all. So they're always off from everybody else. I know, Nick. She is awesome. Uh, the actress, Lizzie, she does an awesome job. It's so good. <laughs> It's environmentally friendly. How so? How does, what makes it environmentally friendly? I think it makes it a pain in my ass. <laughs> the series is called Castle Rock. It's on Hulu. There's two seasons. They're both excellent. And it's spooky. It's perfect time to watch it. You don't do it in Brazil anymore. You're lucky. It's such a pain. It, by, just about the time I get used to the time, then it changes again. You don't use electricity for the lights if it's brighter longer? Um, are you American? Because <laughs> people here just use electricity like there's no tomorrow no matter what. That's true. Time is just a human construct, Claire. But I don't know if we want to get that deep into it in the stream. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I hate it. I hate... I like... Um, I like it getting dark earlier because I like the dark better. But I hate it when it changes. Okay, Alex, what are we going to do about your getting on the Dean's list? You got to go do some more assignments. I should have just had him write a stupid term paper. What, how many hours do we have? Let's see if we can do it. Let's see. College. Write term paper. Let's go. Yeah, I mean, I use pretty much the same amount of electricity all the time. Um, I don't, I only have my lights on if I absolutely have to. I like it dark. I like it as dark and black as my soul. <laughs> Yeah, you get an extra hour one time, but the other time you get an extra an hour less. And I hate it. I hate it so much. <laughs> I like when it gets dark earlier. Yeah, I do. I like it dark. I guess it de depends because I work from home, obviously. So I don't have to be out in the dark. So I could understand if you didn't like it getting dark because it was, you know, you're getting off work and it's pitch black at 5 p.m. That'd be annoying. DSL, oh, daylight saving. <laughs> I read that as DSL, like the internet service. And I was like, what do you mean you DSL ends? Spring forward, fall back. Yeah, that's how I remember it. Exactly, Dayton. That's how I feel. I love it when I get the extra hour of sleep, and I hate it when I get the, the hour taken away. But I just wish we could just stay the same and not have any hours added or taken away. Let me just keep the same schedule always. <laughs> CNN's full of crap. It's to reduce electricity usage. I don't believe it reduces electricity usage. I don't believe that. <laughs> I really don't. <laughs> we all just live in a state of flux <laughs> yep this is the only time i've ever done a, a term paper and it's just because alex wants to get on the dean's list and i'm sick of making him do uh assignments over and over i'm trying to see what he's typing i want to translate somebody needs to translate that is it just gibberish I can't see it close enough. Is it just gibberish or did they actually write word, you know, write words? Cause you can translate simlish if you didn't know. <laughs> wow. 
Just keep adding hours. Yes, please. Add more hours to my life. <laughs> it does look very outdated. It does. I mean, it looks like you're he's typing this on a word processor from 1987. It keeps going even when he's not typing. Look, he's not even typing on the keyboard. <laughs> Look at his hands. <laughs> he's just typing. <laughs> I never noticed that before, but on this laptop, he's not typing on the actual keyboard. <laughs> <laughs> he's typing in front of it. How are you doing that? He's got magic hands, mama. <laughs> Dear Lucy, I don't miss you. <laughs> That's not how a computer works. <laughs> oh my god, Alex. Okay, so that makes me not want to use this computer anymore. That's bothersome to me. I never noticed that um, until now, but I, I think I'm not going to use this computer anymore. He is getting close to... I think I have another one that's exactly the same price, so... Yeah. You pretending to be working when your boss comes by. <laughs> I know the computer screen does look so old. Yeah. In blue, blue fonts. Who types in blue? Who types their term paper in blue? You know? Oh, he did it. He did it. Look, he has no fun, but he did it. Let's see. Oh, yeah. He's going to get on the Dean's list. You better believe it. Um, but he needs to go to sleep now. He needs to go to sleep. We have eight hours until final exam. So there's just enough time for him to get a good night's sleep. The font's really big too, yeah. The font's really big and it's in blue. Blue color. He gave himself a pat on the back. He was very proud of himself. <laughs> oh, God. Look at this pathetic progress now. Okay, actually, it's pretty good. Not so pathetic this time, are we, Alex? <laughs> I don't know why I said it like that. <laughs> I'm just perpetually angry at him. <laughs> Aw, thank you, Sig. And hello, I am Lori. He's using Temple OS. <laughs> Okay, five hours, guys. Five hours until final exams. Let's check in on Tasha. Um, her energy is full, so I'm going to go ahead and get her up. Let's get her some food. And let's get her some fun. Let's get her some rub-a-dub-dub -dub in the tub. <laughs> it's time to go. It's time to graduate and have that baby. And she's going to be, like, in platinum after this. She's going to be so happy. And I am so proud of her. Let me just say, she managed this very difficult pregnancy while she managed to keep her grades up enough to graduate from college. I can't even imagine that. Yeah, Alex is the only one who got skilled in college. <laughs> she is going to go into labor at her finals, yeah. She's going to be going into labor the minute she gets back, probably. He got ripped. <laughs> it, yeah, that's what the blue font reminds me of, too. The old, old computer screens, like the old IBMs that we used to have when I was, like, in elementary school. <laughs> Well, hello to Czech Republic. I used to have a really good friend from Czech Republic named Veronica. Um, she was Get a... Wrapped. I don't remember where from. <laughs> she was an exchange student in my high school. And we went to a Corn and Rob Zombie concert together whenever we were 16. <laughs> and I will never forget her. <laughs> and every time I think of Czech Republic, that's what I think of. <laughs> her name was Veronica with a K. <laughs> baby god i know thank you adam i'm getting good i'm getting good at throwing my voice <laughs> oregon trail yes i used to love oregon trail you studied abroad in the czech republic wow <laughs> and yeah she was a foreign exchange student in my tiny little southern town we had two foreign exchange students and she was one of them you saw corn on your 17th birthday. That's the only uh, concert I'm embarrassed to tell people I went to. Although Rob Zombie was awesome live. Let me say that he put on an awesome show. <laughs> it's pretty and cheap. Oh, wow. 
Uh, thank you so much for three months, KM. And thank you for the follow, Kinsey. I don't know if I said thank you for that follow, but thank you for that follow. I know, I feel bad for the foreign exchange students who had to come to my town too. But that's why when I, when Veronica and I became friends, I had to take her, I was like, we gotta do something fun before you go back home. So we're gonna go, we went to the, the nearest big city and went to a concert. <laughs> Their first day at your school was on America Day. <laughs> you have a friend named Veronica from Czech Republic, wow. <laughs> And you met her you met her due to exchange program. Oh my god, did you go to the same school as me? <laughs> okay, Tasha is going. She needs to pee and, and take a shower, but that's okay. Her her comfort's good, her hunger's good, and her energy's good, so she's not gonna die on us. Uh they're going to class. They're going to their final exam, y'all. This is it, the moment of truth. They're both gonna graduate. Ale we have to remember Alexander still has 500 cash in there. Yeah, we had Oregon Trail and we had like the math game in our in our computers, our elementary school computers. Yeah, she was spending the freaking money on that stupid game. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Um Alex got 1200, so he's got 1700 we need to deposit and Tasha got 500. 17 and 5. Help me remember. Alexander got on the dean's list. Yes, I know you need fun. And she's gonna be going into labor like literally any moment now. Oh, here she goes. <laughs> here she goes. Who just screamed? Did you guys just hear that scream? Icy Tower. No, I don't remember that one, Adam. Oh, it's the oh, it's Jacqueline. It's the cafeteria lady. There's a college student giving birth on the sidewalk outside the dorms. <laughs> Okay. Oh, it's a boy. It's a boy. Okay, we're gonna name him after Come Alex. On, find your pelvis. I know you've got one, and it's okay to move it for heaven's sake. Yes. <laughs> I know you've got a pelvis, and it's okay to move it. All right. Yes. <laughs> the goth heir. Oh, look. He's, he looks like his dad. Look, he's got darker skin. He's got black hair. Now, what will his name be? What will his name be, guys? I'm going to the uh, baby name suggestion. Thank you for everybody who put your suggestions in here. And we're gonna go for a boy name. And we're gonna go for the letter V. Ooh, I hope we get Victor. Doesn't Victor Goth just sound good? Okay, here we go. Vance. Vance. Ooh, we got Vance Goth. All right. Whoever submitted Vance, thank you very much for your contributions. <laughs> Vance Goth. All right, here we go. Vance Refrigeration. <laughs> yes, yes, you've been watching The Office. Okay, except Vance Goth. Oh, it reminds me of Vance Joy. <laughs> That was you, Letty. Oh, thank you. Good name. Good name. <laughs> thank you for the follow, Belma. And thank you for the follow, Moose Moose. Moose Moose 64. <laughs> Aw, okay. He's going to own a refrigeration company, y'all. He's got green eyes, black hair, and he's got the same skin. He's got darker skin, which neither of his parents have. So he must have got a recessive gene from Alexander. Uh, he got Bella's skin tone. Okay, and does Tasha have green eyes? Is that where he got his green eyes from? Tasha, come here. Let me look inside of your head. Yep, she has green eyes. So he got a little bit from both sides. I love it. Aw. So I guess now they're ready to move back uh, to Pleasant View. Let's go ahead and have them deposit their money in. Alexander, you can go first. Or is he gonna go see his baby? Okay, hold on. He's gonna go see his baby first. Let's 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 watch that. Oh, look, he's happy. He's happy. Let's do a screenshot. Let's do a screenshot of the baby born. Baby born, baby born. I got you, J Jade. I got gotcha. you. I got your screenshot right here. <laughs> that sounded unnecessarily antagonistic, didn't it? I got your screenshot right here. <laughs> Baby born, baby born. Here we go. There we go. That's cute. It's cute. <laughs> that should be Lucy's baby. I know, but it's Tasha's. It's Tasha's. <laughs> baby has been ejected. Okay. Aw. 
All right, so Alex is happy to be a father right after he graduated college. I'm so happy. The, the timing was like perfect on this baby. Okay, so he. Ne I know you need fun, Alex, but you got to go put your money in the bank, okay? You got to do grown-up things now. You have a child. So we're going to go bank online. I know I didn't have to juggle anything. Yeah, that was really nice. And deposit. How much did I say? 1700 Bank online, deposit 500 And this is going to be a threefer. This is going to require three deposits to get that 1700 in there. <sighs> That's okay, though. <laughs> you think I'd be the bad girl in an 80s high school movie? Yeah. No, I'd be the dark, mysterious, misunderstood girl. I'd be like, if I were a character from The Breakfast Club, I would be the girl in the trench coat. <laughs> By the way, I freaking love The Breakfast Club. That's one of my favorite movies ever. I love all 80s uh, John Hughes movies. Anything with Molly Ringwald in it, I am there. 16 Candles, Pretty in Pink, Breakfast Club. I love them all. <laughs> the Pixie Stick Captain Crunch Sandwich. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I would not be mean, though. I was never mean. I was never mean. I was bullied a lot in high school. Because I was a weirdo. <laughs> Alexander has 4,400 on, on deposit. Oh, 4,600. That's a good way to start off his life. Although he is going to be getting more uh, from his family. Okay, and Tasha. Oh my God, Tasha. What'd you do with the baby? I know she put that baby on the ground. I knew it. I knew she did. Mr. Mom. Oh my God, I haven't seen that in years. I haven't seen that in years. You'd be the nerdy boy in the breakfast club. <laughs> I haven't I haven't seen that in so long. Jake Ryan is turning in 60? What? Oh man. He's rich and ripped. <laughs> He's an organic grass fed baby. Oh cry baby from John Waters. I love John Waters. And John Waters. I, can't, I don't want to talk about it too much because I don't want people to like think I'm some kind of pervert, but <laughs> I love John Waters. <laughs> oh, Ferris Bueller, yes. I love Ferris Bueller. Ferris Bueller's Day Off. Those are the movies I watch when I'm sick in bed, you know? Yeah, the baby lives outside now. This is a grass baby, okay? <laughs> They're raising him very naturally. Did she go deposit her money yet? No, she was going to the bathroom. Okay, let's have her deposit her money, and then we're going to have them all move back to Pleasant View. Um, bank online and deposit 500 And they can divide up the, the last 28 bucks. He's a plant, baby. <laughs> Vance the grass-type Pokemon. <laughs> I know nothing about Pokemon. <laughs> I know nothing about it. My little brother used to love Pokemon when he was a kid. I bought him a bunch of Pokemon cards, and that's the extent of my knowledge. Mm, I haven't seen Easy A, no. No, I haven't seen that. I need. I want to watch that, though. Okay, so let's see here. We're moving back. Let's move Alex back first. No, you don't have time to eat. You gotta move. You can eat when you get back home. Let's get out of here. Move back to Pleasant View. Now, let's see what kind of ridiculous clothing he's going to age up into now. I mean, this was his college outfit. Seriously, this is what he wore in college. I don't... He's dressing like a 65-year-old man. You play Pokemon Go every day? <laughs> they don't care about that, baby. <laughs> oh, my God. Tasha's last name is half... He's wearing a suit. It is half of Alex's. He's wearing a suit. <laughs> Alexander can move out now. Oh my god, Alex. Okay. I mean, this is so him, though. This is so him. He stays true to form. That's right, Joe. His outfit got... He got older. His outfit got older. Yes, move out now. Um, Tasha's gonna take the baby with her. Her. What should I do? Yeah, I'm gonna have Tasha take the baby with her. I don't see Alex taking the baby with him. They're, they're just gonna get married anyway. Or maybe we should just move them all out together. Yeah, I think you're right. I think you're right. I think we should have them just... Let's just have them all move out together. 
um, Tasha and Vance. Let's have them all move out together because he wants to get married anyway. Yeah, he wants to marry a rich sim, but you don't get everything you want, Alex, okay? Sorry, you're not going to be able to marry a rich girl because there's only one girl who loves you, and that's Tasha. So you better take what you can get here, buddy. <laughs> yeah, I moved them all. <laughs> Leave the baby. <laughs> Mary, you're killing me. <laughs> okay, so they're all moving out. Come on, Tasha. Oh, did Tasha age up? Hold on. Did we miss her aging up? Oh my God, look what she's wearing, y'all. She wants to be a true goth. <laughs> She she aged up into the Wendy Wednesday Adams dress and I love it. Yes. Yeah, she's like she's got to fit into the goth house. <laughs> I love it so much. <laughs> it is Cassandra's dress. She's I think she's trying to emulate Cassandra. She's trying to emulate Cassandra. Yeah, Tasha gets it. She gets it. <laughs> The budget is 28 simoleons. Um, okay, they can take all of that money with them. I think, right? If I give them all the money, they won't get the 20, the 20,000, I think. Yeah. Okay. All right, guys. We're done with another round of college. I cannot believe it. Feels like this game is moving. This playthrough is moving so fast. We've already made it through two complete rounds of Pleasant View. Okay, I'm going to save. They didn't have anything here they needed to bring to take with them. I don't think so. Well, it doesn't matter. It's too late now. All right. Woo. The, the baby is, the baby's with them. The baby will appear wherever they, wherever they land. Okay. So let's go back to, back to Pleasant View. Back to, Ple back to Pleasant View. We've, we've only done half of the stream so far. So we're going to go back to uh, Cassandra and Dawn now. Yeah, uh, Cassandra's definitely going to give them give Alex his chunk of the fortune. I always do that because it just makes sense to me. And they wouldn't just send him out there with 4,000 simoleons. So they've got 4,600 plus whatever Tasha had. I think she had a couple grand. And then they're going to get their part of Alex's inheritance. And they're going to buy their own house. I always move them. I always move Alex into this house right here. Um, I like this house for him. It's it's affordable, but it's nice enough that they can fix it up. It's got room for a couple kids. And I, I just like that house for them. And we could move them into this one, but I don't know. I like to put the burbs in there usually. Yeah, it is kind of weird that she's trying to look like his sister. It is kind of weird. <laughs> okay, so I don't know. Should we go ahead and... They only have 28 simoleons because we have to get their money out. So here's what I'm going to do. When we go back over to the Lotharios, which we're going now, we got our little twinsies. We got our little Twinkies over here, which they're going to be aging up to children too. Do, 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 do. We could move them into that house next door to the Goss. I hate that house really, but we could fix it up, I guess. Do, 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 do. You're talking about this one here? Yeah, this house, 105 Sim Lane. It is a travesty on the inside. You can't even put a double bed in any of the bedrooms. So you have to work on it. Look, Dawn doesn't want to have a baby. <laughs> Too bad, Dawn. I'm sure you're going to have another one soon enough. Cassandra wants to, but she also fears it. Oh, man, what are we going to do with this family? I think since they both don't want to, maybe we could have Cassandra go on birth control for a little while. Since she doesn't since she doesn't want to, this is what I normally do in my gameplay rules for The Sims 2. If my Sim does not want to have a baby by fearing having a baby, then I will let them go on birth control. So, yeah, I don't know why she's not doing good. I don't know. Um, I think she probably had one of her fears realized. I don't know what it was, though. So, okay, no, not pregnancy. How do I do birth control? Is it the, is it this one? Sim settings, pregnancy, birth control. Okay, so Cassandra is going on birth control. She is having a rough time with these twins. She does want to have another child in the future, but her fear tells me that she doesn't want to have another child right now. So I'm going to put her on birth control until she no longer has this fear, and then she can go off of it. 
Okay, so now she can put some flex tape on it. <laughs> I don't know what her deal is. She wants to play and entertain, so maybe we can have her do some of these types of things. But first of all, um, we're going to have her go and go ahead and give Alex his money. She's been holding on to this for him until he graduated. And let's see. We're going to bank online, and we're going to transmit to the household funds of a playable sim. And we're going to go with 50000 that's just an arbitrary number that I came up with. I don't want to give him too much money. And he will get more uh, later after Cassandra dies. <laughs> uh, what does that sound? Oh, no. She's an aspiration failure. Um, her memories are a bunch of memories about people aging up. Yeah, Mortimer died. Mortimer died, so that did it. That did it for her. So now she's having to get therapy to deal with the death of her father. Thank you so much for the follow. Oh, Unicorn Spike Sparkles, thank you for the follow 10 minutes ago. And thank you for the follow Crow Venom. Thank you. She's getting therapy to help her deal with this. Yeah, in her underwear. <laughs> in her underwear. <laughs> Okay, is she feeling better? Is she feeling better? Yes, yes. Okay, now she's going to give Alex his money. And then we're going to try to... Maybe we'll work on Potter tra Potter training? Potty training Oscar. Let's check on the babies. Let's check on the babies. Although they're toddlers and not really babies. Yeah, she's born to suffer, I know. Okay, so we got little Kia. Or Kiara, not Kia. Who... Who the heck did we name Kia? That was in Sims 3, huh? God, I'm starting to get all my games mixed up. <laughs> okay, so Kiara here, um, she's doing fine. We, she could use some food and go to the potty. And Oscar needs to be potty trained. So do we have a potty in here? Yes, we do. Yes, we do. I know. I wish a, a therapist suddenly appeared whenever I was having a breakdown, too. That'd be nice. Oh, I see. I saw the butler coming. No, butler. You need your hair changed, Stephen Anthony. He's going to give the babies a bottle. Okay, that's cool. Okay, so we need to transfer this to Alex. Okay, how come Alex isn't showing up here? Hmm. Why is he not showing up? Is it because he's in the simp bin? Okay, so here's what we'll do. We will just tra we will just donate the money and then we'll just cheat Alex the money. It'll it's the same thing. So let's bank online, let's donate fifty thousand. That'll do the trick. That'll do it. Yeah, I think it's because he's in the bin. He's not in the trash. <laughs> Okay, come on, Cassandra. Let's go, baby. Let's go potty train your baby. Make you feel better. Okay, potty train Oscar. I'm glad they have a butler to help out. And where the hell's Don? I haven't been paying attention to him at all. He's down there playing, playing chess. And he's really tired. Um, he has to go to work at 6 p.m., so I think I'm going to have him go to bed. Go go sleep for a while. And he want what does he want to do? Play with Nina? He wants to woohoo with 10 sims, make out with 5 sims, of course. His regular old routine. We're giving Alex a mother load, alright. <laughs> We're giving him a mother load. Dawn is worried about Dawn. Sounds right. <laughs> oh, I I didn't choose the bin. That's all right. We'll we'll fix we'll get it done. <laughs> okay, come on. She's not going to potty train him. So we got to try something else. She wants to play with. Let's play with him. Um play toss him in the air. We we got to do anything to get her mood up. Anything we can do. Yes, we're all very proud. Toss him in the air now. Toss him in the air. This this guy, he looks exactly like John Burb. Hey, why are you taking my baby away? Hey. Okay. 
Why'd you change his diaper twice? Did he have that big of a load? Okay, I know, Cassandra. I know. I'm trying here. I'm trying my best. <laughs> Toss in air. Um, yeah. I don't know what's going on here. Steven Anthony, get the heck back. Cassandra's having a breakdown here. She needs to play with her baby. <laughs> oh, we got a screenshot? Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, that's a that's a screen. Let's get a screenshot of him pulling a trash bag through Cassandra's body. <laughs> oh, oh, what was that? What was that? Did somebody tell me what happened because I didn't see it. Did somebody donate? Did somebody donate? Tell me so I can tell him thank you. <laughs> he looks exactly like John. He does, for some reason, whatever happened just didn't show up on my timeline, so I have no idea if somebody just donated to me. So somebody tell me if you guys saw it. Someone donated? Who donated and how much? <laughs> I'm asking you guys, because I don't know. <laughs> or at least who. I want to thank them. I have to go pull up my stream elements, I guess. Yeah, he has eyebrows. He has eyebrows. Anonymous donated? Okay, hold on. I don't know why my donations do not show up in my uh, panel and it has to go like all the way over to this other thing. I don't know. I'm gonna find out right now who donated so I can thank them. If it's anonymous, thank you, anonymous. Thank you. <laughs> thank you for donating activity feed. Anonymous tip $20. Oh, thank you so much. Thanks for always entertaining us with your streams. We love you, Cindy. Aw, oh, thank you so much, Anonymous. I really appreciate that. That is so kind of you. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't know what was going on there. All right, I got it. I got it. I'm just gonna have to keep my stream elements open too, I guess. Okay. Oh, it was you? It was you, Sam. Aw, oh, Sam. You sweetheart, thank you. You should be embarrassed. <laughs> thank you. I really appreciate that. I appreciate all my donations. Thank you guys. Okay. Um. No, she is not. Oh, could she already be pregnant? Hmm, I don't know. That's a good question. That's a good question. <laughs> Let's take a screenshot of this of this travesty though. Okay, that's a, that's a screenshot. That's a keeper. That's a keeper. He's just pulling the trash right through her guts. Let's get another one. <laughs> yeah, we can check. Hold on. Um, I don't think she is, but I don't remember how many times they woohooed last time. Okay, she's playing with the baby. That made her feel a little bit better. Get a pet. Oh my god, we don't have a pet store. So I'm sorry. You can't, we can't do that. Let's see, does he need to, he needs to go to sleep. Put Oscar in the crib. And we'll check and see if she's prego, but I don't think she is. Nope, she's not. She is not. Okay. Prego nap. <laughs> I'm kind of glad. I'm kind of glad because twins is, is hard enough, but at least we have the butler to help us out. So Oscar's being put to bed, and then, okay, let's try to potty train this one, Kiara. Let's try to potty train Kiara. Come on, get off get, get off your toy. John Burb the butler, get out of here. He probably uses the same face template that John Burb uses, which I think is face template number two, and the same hair. Oh, I got to save game. All right. I'll save right now. Hmm. Did we get a commercial break seven minutes ago from Kate? Oh, my God. He's a burbler. <laughs> we got a commercial break, y'all. Okay, this is the perfect time. This is the perfect time to watch one. Let me see what we got here. Commercial breaks. Okay, so where was I? Where was I? Okay, um, okay, we've got Iron Brew advert from Kinky Oreo. 
<laughs> okay, the only reason why I'm watching this is, well, not the only reason, but Iron Brew I know of because Marcus drinks it on last podcast on the left. If any, if I have any of my last podcast fans in here, you know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about, that Iron Brew. <laughs> so let's watch it. Let's see here. More flex tape. <laughs> I've never had Iron Brew before. Have you guys had Iron Brew? Tell me what it tastes like. It is kind of scary. <laughs> okay, thank you for sharing that. Let's see. <laughs> it tastes like bubble gum. That's what I've heard. Yeah. Yay! Last podcast fans unite, represent, or something. I don't know. <laughs> Last podcast is amazing, but you have to have a certain sense of humor. So if you don't like foul, extremely expletive humor <laughs> don't watch it i mean don't listen to it <laughs> i love it it's right up my alley you have it in scotland and it's just okay or you have in scotland it's just okay last podcast my favorite too I, i've listened to every single episode and i listen to every single episode every week side stories and the main show and i watch all of their streams every week too by the way <laughs> How do I feel about servos? I feel nothing for servos. I feel nothing. I never use them. I never play with them. I don't know why. I would play with them. Um, I just never like gotten there in my gameplay. It did not taste like gum to you? What did it taste like to you? Good. If you like that kind of humor, you should listen to it. It is hilarious. But yeah, I mean, really, I don't like my favorite murder, to be honest with you. I don't like the girls. I don't like the hosts. They get on my nerves. <laughs> I don't know what it is. I tried and I just can't. I just can't. Okay, I know, Cassandra. I know. I'm so sorry. I'm trying my best to make you happy, okay? You're just, your life is terrible. Let's go get you some food. Babby did a poo poo. <laughs> oh, thank you for the cheer, Nick. Oh, and I got a, sh I got a shout out from Mirror's Edge. Thank you, Cindy, for playing this awesome game. Thank you so much for watching me play this awesome game, Mirror's Edge. Thank you. Toddler needs to go to bed. Oh, let's see. Let's put her to bed. Wait, which one is that? Oh, yeah. Okay, she does need to go to bed. I, I get them mixed up. I can't tell which one is which. That's Kiara. Okay. Okay, Cassandra, please stop crying and put your baby to bed. Let's get you some food, honey. She's crying. <laughs> That's what you tell yourself, Steph. <laughs> it grew on you? Yeah. I Maybe I should give it another try. I don't know. I only tried to listen to it once or twice. And she didn't get into it. Yes, I am streaming on Halloween. I am streaming Strange Town on Halloween. Okay, well, you cried so much that the butler had to put your baby down. That sounded bad. Put your baby down. <laughs> I'm. We're streaming Ophelia on Halloween, and I got my uh, I got my uh, costume, which I got to try it on. I think I'm gonna try on my costume after the stream. I got to make sure everything works right. Because I only have a couple days left if I need to reorder something or return something. <laughs> Thank goodness for Amazon Prime shipping, right? Yeah, we're gonna do we're gonna do Ophelia and then I we might go do some trick or treating in The Sims Three. I thought about that too. Yeah, it's it's gonna be uh, ten a.m. my time. I don't know what time that is wherever the heck you guys are. <laughs> Same time as my usual Saturday stream. I'm not telling you what I'm dressing up as. It's a surprise. I'm going to surprise you with my costume. 
No clues. No clues at all, Zoe. It's the middle of the night for you, Joe. I know. I'm sorry. <laughs> Does anyone else think the new Sims 4 expansion pack will flop? Um, I really don't know. I think generally the it was the reception was more positive, way more positive than the whole Star Wars thing. Obviously, everybody was pissed off about that. Um, but wh whether or not the expansion itself will be good, who knows? Your guess is as good as mine. I think from just from what I've seen so far, I feel like it could have been really good, but it's going to be executed poorly, leaving out a lot of things that would have made it fun, just like most of The Sims 4. And then hopefully there'll be some good mods to come out to help make it more enjoyable. But I also haven't seen any gameplay yet. That's just based on what I've seen from the trailer and what I've read on The Sims website. Um, they're actually doing a gameplay trailer. The Sims the Sims team is doing a gameplay trailer this Friday. So I will be watching that and possibly making a video about it if I think I have enough material. <laughs> okay, did she eat? Yes, she did. Let's put away these leftovers because we need all this food. We need all this food. <laughs> the lack of smoke alarm, Joe. <laughs> Sometimes I just like to live on the edge. And just not give my Sims a smoke alarm. <laughs> there is snow depth, Brid uh, Bridgie. There is snow depth in the new pack. Um, if you, in the trailer, they, I don't know if it's the trailer or if it's a still image. I think it was like actually in the trailer. You can see their feet su has sunk beneath the snow. Unless that was just a trick. Like they've been known to do, but I do believe there's going to be a uh, snow depth. Okay, I feel so bad for Cassandra. Like, I don't even know what to do anymore. Maximize a skill? Oh, God. She's so far from maximizing any skill. <sighs> Creativity. What's her ho her hobby is freaking tinkering. Make her form babby. She doesn't want to. She's on birth control right now. <laughs> okay. Um, Is the baby awake? So we can try to potty train him again. Oh, he is. He is. He doesn't really need to go to the potty, but what the heck? Let's get him some smart milk. Oh, she can't make smart milk? <laughs> what am I thinking? She can't make smart milk. Oh, well, let's just go potty train him anyway. Well, Don's asleep. but Well, he's about to wake up, actually. He's about to wake up. But he doesn't want to go on a date, so no. The answer is no. <laughs> he wants to have a party. Maybe he'll roll a date one when he wakes up. Um, Come on, Cassandra. Get up here. Potty train your baby. Potty train your baby. She can't do she can't do smart milk right now because she's in the red. Maybe Dawn can. Oh! Farts! Who farted in here? <laughs> Nick, did you fart? <laughs> Send her on a run and she's fine. <laughs> The baby did it. Don wants to. Oh, he does want to go on a date. That's a good. That's a good point. Let's have a little home date. Let's have a little home date to get her mood up because she is. She's tanking. She's doing bad, y'all. She's gonna have another breakdown. Don. Oh, he's already on his way over here to goose her. He's gonna. He's gonna make her feel better. Cause Don does love Cassandra despite the fact that he cheats on her all the time. He does love her in his own way. He doesn't want her to feel bad. Does he want to be freaking be friends with Lilith? Um, let's ask. Am I clicking on the wrong person? No. Why can't I? How is Bubby formed? How girl get pregnant? <laughs> Miraville, I am not continuing the Veronaville series right now because nobody watches my Let's Plays. They do very, very poorly on my channel. So I'm only doing gameplay right now in the streams. Now, I might come back again in the future if all of a sudden Let's Plays decide to perform well again. But I just don't have time to make content that people are not going to watch. So, sorry. Sorry to bust your bubble. <laughs> okay, so let's ask on date. We might stream it. We might stream Veronaville in the future. We could finish. Uh, we could pick up where we left off. That's the most I've ever played Veronaville too. <laughs> 
No, Let's Plays are dead. Yeah. I know that a there are a lot of people who like Let's Plays, but my Let's Play would get like 5,000 views, and then my video about mods would get like 30,000 views. And it's just, you know, it's economy. I'm sorry. <laughs> But a streaming, streaming it, yeah. Streaming it we could do. Maybe we could do a Veronaville every once in a while. Okay, are you guys on a date or what? What are you doing? Um, tell joke, entertain, play with. Okay, we can do all that. So we're going to tell her a joke. I don't think you wanted to tell a dirty joke. <laughs> yeah, nobody does Let's Plays anymore because they just... Your channel won't grow doing them anymore. It's it's unfortunate, but YouTube has changed a lot. Yeah, most people stream their Let's Plays. That's what I do now. And I prefer it, honestly. I prefer to stream rather than make Let's Play videos. But I still make Let's Plays for my channel members. <laughs> yeah. I know that I have, a, I have an audience who does like them, but it's, it's just, it is what it is. Okay, talk to Cassandra. Let's do a smooth talk. Let's see how she's doing. Let's do what she wants. I was doing what Dawn wants. Slow dance, tickle, pillow. Oh my god, you want to do all these stupid things. Okay, let's let's tickle. Let's do a tickle. <laughs> yeah. You get confused of the order, yeah. <laughs> Okay, what what's happening? What's happening? She's better, yay! She's no longer in the red. She fears Dawn is stinky. Uh, dance with Dawn, entertain Dawn, and appreciate Dawn. Okay, so let's entertain him. Let's tell him a joke. Let's give him a little, give him a little back rub. <laughs> he kind of is stinky. <laughs> Toddlers screaming in the background. Nobody cares. They're trying to get their romance on here. <laughs> Okay, let's check on the babies. They're fine. They're fine. Whatever. The butler can take care of them. That's what the butler's for. <laughs> okay, let's check Cassandra. Oh, she wants to make out with Dawn. Okay, she's doing better already. She's doing better already. Let's do a make out. Yeah, that is true, uh, Kay. Yeah. You can't, you can no longer do just an unedited Let's Play. You're not going to get anywhere like that. I do heavily edit my Let's Plays, but still they don't perform as well. Oh, she wants to woohoo with him. Good thing she's on birth control. Thank you so much for the follow, honey Jay. And not, a lot of the big channels don't even do Let's Plays anymore. Not very many of them do anyway. Okay, Don has a day off today. Oh, I thought he had to go to work. Okay, so let's do a woohoo on the bed. Completely safe woohoo for the first time ever in my game. Completely safe. <laughs> Does she no longer fear? Oh, she no longer fears it. That's true, but I'm just going to let her keep keep on it. When did she unroll that fear? Oh, well... It's too late. I just noticed. It's too late. They're going to have a safe woohoo for once. We're going to let them go through with it. But then, yeah, I am going to take her off birth control because she doesn't have the fear anymore and she wants to have a baby. <laughs> She's ready to form, baby. <laughs> she is ready. Bella Goth returned and had a baby with Daniel Pleasant. Oh, my God. I bet that'd be a cute baby, though. And let's let's check on the little ones here. Oh, they're doing pretty good. They're doing okay. The butler's around here somewhere. No consequences to this woohoo for the first time ever. You two suggestions are awful for you. They usually do an okay job for me, but now all I get all I get recommended is toy commercials. Sim stuff and wig reviews. <laughs> That's what my YouTube is. <laughs> oh, the baby's adorable. Okay, come on, guys. Hurry up. Hurry up with your, your making out. You're taking forever. 
You're taking forever. There they go. Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and take, oh, oh, hello. Hello, Oscar, what's wrong with you? He needs a bath. Okay, Cassandra's feeling like a lot better now. She's actually the platinum now. Okay, all right, that's what I'm talking about. So I don't really care too much about the rest of the date. I think we can end the date now. <laughs> Thank you for that date, honey. I got babies to take care of now. <laughs> <laughs> okay oh two days left guys two days left until the birthdays and then we're gonna have children we're gonna get to see them age up for sure because we still have like over an hour left it's it helps that we have the butler here to help take care of them but i'm gonna have cassandra go give this baby a are you bringing him a flower go bathe oscar thanks that was really fun let's do it again soon no, John Burbler. Leave my babies alone. Cassandra wants to take care of the babies. <laughs> hey, Zinnia, welcome. He saw Don's pelvis. <laughs> Don't be afraid to move it, okay? Yeah, they can they can afford therapy. That's true. <laughs> I, I think I should make that my Sims have to pay every time the therapist comes. Like, you gotta pay 500 simoleons for that. Therapy ain't cheap, y'all. Therapy ain't cheap. <laughs> you added the butler, no nanny. Well, I like him to nanny. Uh, most of the time, unless I'm trying to do something. Like, most of the time I like him to help out, though. Especially when we have twins. Because it's rough without somebody to help. I guess we could hire a separate nanny, but yeah, he's moved his pelvis all over town. <laughs> oh God, they are worse than the nanny. It's true, they are. But right now he's helping. He's helping more than he's hurting. <laughs> yeah, they can afford a nanny and a butler. It's they can. But I like the butler because he comes at a certain time. He leaves at a certain time. I mean, I know the nanny can track your work schedule, but I like this better. Okay. Oh, did I say thank you for the follow, Honey J? Thank you for the follow. And we got a commercial break. So let's save here. And let's go see what kind of commercial we got. What do you guys have for me? Okay, we watched Flex Tape. We watched Iron Brew. We got Sky Dancers. Oh, my God. I remember these. I remember these. I'm going to come back to these, though, because I already watched a lot of Sammies. But I'm going to come back to these. What? The pregnant puppy and kitty? Okay, hold on. I gotta watch this one. Barbie posh pets, kitten and puppy. Oh, I gotta see this. I would have loved this as a kid. Do you guys remember pound puppies? I, I haven't seen those in so long. Oh, stop. I used to have a bunch of pound puppies. And I just wonder if I'm the only one who remembers that. More jazzercise. That's what we need. Oh, yeah. My uh, YouTube also recommends me jazzercise now so thank you guys thank you <laughs> it, it Djibouti dubs um sim stuff toys the simpsons i don't even watch the simpsons um gives me a bunch of weird stuff but that's i mean that's just the sidebar that's not my actual recommendeds but still it's it's very similar oh you guys can't even see that <laughs> sitting here showing you my youtube it doesn't you couldn't even see it see we need that emote sammy we need that emote <laughs> you remember the cartoon pound puppies are so cute i'm gonna look them up and show them to you in a second um but anyway this commercial team nick oh wow my darling cat surprised me today a newborn kitty let's cuddle and play a newborn Marta kitty left, Marta left, surprised me with kitty number two then number three so <laughs> i know you are sammy Marta don't left, worry left, i'm <laughs> not rushing you kitty arrives. Now a friend shows up, up, like these sweet beats oh yeah mary we probably have like the same youtube <laughs> Wow, that's... I don't think I've ever seen those before. Uh, I don't know what it's recommending me there. You guys can see what it's recommending me. <laughs> I wonder if we can do... Uh, let's look up... Let me look up pound puppies. Pound 
puppies. I don't know if I want to do a video. Um, oh, because it used to be a cartoon. They had a Pound Puppies cartoon. So there's a, the videos are just a bunch of cartoons, but let me show you the pictures. It's like the, it's these. This is what they look like. This is a little box they came in. Remember these? Pound Puppies. They were so cute. They were like flat and they had a little heart, little like thing on them. I don't know. Better than pet rocks, I guess. I don't know why I liked these when I was a kid, okay? Now they look really boring. But they were fun. Oh, look, newborns. They have diapers on them. <laughs> they have diapers? What? Why? Why do they have diapers? You had a bunch of the tiny ones. Yeah, they had all, they had little small ones, medium ones, and then big ones. They had, like, here's a kid. She loves her. See, they had a little pound puppy thing, like a tattoo on him. I remember that always being, like, the hard part. Yeah, with the ones in the, that had the ones in the belly. Yes, yes, like this, like this. So it would have a little baby one inside of it. It fit inside of it. <laughs> Puppy surprise. <laughs> yeah, so anyway, that was a thing like in the 80s, 90s. I remember, I don't know. I thought of it. <laughs> okay, thank you for sharing that one. And hold on, we'll, we'll do one more. We'll do one more. Oh my God, that is horrifying. I'm going to come back to that one. Oh, Steph Always Sims added some uh, Mouser Size from 1983. Did we watch Mouser Size before? I think we did, y'all. I think we did watch Let's some of this. Size. Look at those 80s hairstyles, y'all. Y'all? <laughs> Steve? Oh, no, it gets worse. How is everyone today? Oh, Lord. Are you all ready to mouser size? No, yeah. no. Okay, now Not remember, ready. before we start, we must Find breathe your properly. pelvis, Mickey. We breathe in, <laughs> and we breathe out. Shh. And Steve. Do it with me. And if you have any Okay, she's not breath, nearly as entertaining as the other lady. Us. But most of all... I want to tell you guys, I found another video of that jazzercise lady. And did you know she was the founder of jazzercise, by the way? I looked her up. And not only that, she is 75 years old right now, and she is killing it. She's looking good. <laughs> she looks like Blanche. She does. She's got the Blanche hair. She's got the Blanche hair. <laughs> she does. Thank you, Steph, for taking us back to that. I got to show you guys this, though. I'm sorry. We're going to get back to The Sims in just a second, I swear. Uh, but I wanted to show you guys the Jazzercise lady. Jazzercise lady? I'm just going to Google that. Can I just Google Jazzercise lady? Judy Shepard Miss It. I searched Jazzercise lady and I swear it just came right up. So this is her. This is her now. This is her now. Yeah. she. So this was her then. <laughs> looking good and this is her now she looks like she got a little a little work done doesn't she <laughs> but still she is looking good for 75 look here she is teaching her class look at her go she got ripped <laughs> she got ripped she's been ripped for like ever there she is that's probably like in the 90s Oh my goodness, she got herself on the front page of Jazzercise Magazine. <laughs> I mean, I would kill to have a body that toned, so I admire her. There she was. That's probably like in the 2000s, I bet, looking good. I love her. She is the best aerobics, aerobics instructor ever, ever. <laughs> okay, now we're done with our history lesson. <laughs> 
our jazzercise history you guys are gonna learn more about jazzercise than you ever wanted to know on this stream okay <laughs> your new goal in life is to be on the cover of a jazzercise magazine <laughs> no i would never guess she was 75 either i would say like upper 50 so she looks really good yeah i can't ever do a freaking diet or exercise properly either i suck i suck at that <laughs> Jazzerzine. <laughs> okay, did you wash that baby, Cassandra? Did you wash that baby? Let's check on him. Oh, he needs to go to the potty. Yes. Let's take him to the potty. Maybe we can get him potty trained. Oscar. Oh, she should have made him some smart milk. Crap. Hold on. Hold on. Let's get some smart milk going. I found her Instagram, too, when I was looking for her. She looks really good. Uh, oh, what am I doing? That's not how you get smart milk. My god. You gotta get it. You gotta get it in here. Okay, where am I gonna put it? Crap. There's nowhere to put it. Let's buy a counter. Just, I just want, all I want, all I want is some smart milk, okay? Why is this so hard? Somebody tell me why this is so hard. Here we go. Now, Cassandra, get that baby some smart milk and then potty train him. I hate to exercise and I hate to cook. And I hate to eat food that's good for me. <laughs> so I, I, I like to eat food that's good for That's not true. I do like to eat food that's good for me. I just also like to eat food that's not good for me. <laughs> but I'm doing better. I'm do actually, so I was started to wa get my walking routine back again. And then it snowed eight inches. And now I'm like, crap, now I can't walk outside. I guess I'm gonna have to do some jazzercise, y'all. Oh my God, I'm doing jazzercise. I'm gonna do it. I'm doing jazzercise with that lady and I'm doing the 80s version. And I'm gonna laugh my ass off while I'm in the living room doing jazz hands. <laughs> okay, did he eat the smart meal? Did he eat it? No, don't, don't, whatever you're doing, stop doing it. Eat the smart milk or drink it or whatever you do with it. I hope you don't eat it. You lost four kilograms, got sick, and put two back on. Yeah, that sounds like my life. <laughs> I'm going to find my pelvis in the living room, y'all. <laughs> nope, not in Minnesota. Not even close. But we did have a winter storm. Eat the chunky smart milk. <laughs> Aw, thank you so much for the three months at tier two, trend. Thank you. Okay, dang it, I'm trying to use that potty. Hey, but at least the butler po uh, potty trains the kids, too. This kid's so exhausted, I'm not going to be able to potty train him. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to buy a second potty. We got two kids. We need two potties. Move that out of the way. Cassandra, stop doing whatever the heck you're doing. Get in here and potty train this baby. I'm working so hard at this. I want this to happen. Glowing baby. He ate all of his smart milk. <laughs> He did. He ate it. It was chunky. <laughs> Come on, Cassandra. Don, get away. Okay, see you later, burbler. That's what I'm gonna call the the uh, butler, the burbler. You should try jazzercise. Totally try it. I mean, that lady is motivating. <laughs> John Poster. Okay, did he get... He didn't get trains? No, he's too tired. Dang it. Alright, put him in the crib. Dawn's up here playing with his daughter. That's so cute. Aw, oh, thank you so much for the uh, 100 bits, Steph Always Sims. Thank you. Cottage cheese is technically chunky milk. Yeah, I love cottage cheese. I just bought some cottage cheese today, actually. I love it. Thank you for the follow, Fesitoli. Fesitoli. I don't know if I'm saying that right. I'm sorry. Don is a very good dad. He's always a good dad in my games. We just wasted smart milk on that child. Um, okay, so this baby, this baby needs to be bathed too. So Don, why don't you, why don't you uh, pitch in here and give Kiara a bath? Oh, I was gonna take Cassandra off of birth control too. Because she no longer fears having a baby, and now she just wants one. Dawn also no longer fears having a baby, so I guess they're ready to move on. The twins are about to be children, too. 
So we're going to go to sim settings. Pregnancy birth control is off. Your cat loves cottage cheese. <laughs> I'm glad. I'm glad, Fez. That's what I'm going to call you Fez because I don't want to keep butchering it. <laughs> Don wants a hot tub. Of course he does. Of course he does. Well, you know what? We got plenty of money. Let's buy him one. Let's buy him one and just put it out here in the back. We still have all this wedding stuff out here. I need to put that up. I got a freaking bat box out here. What am I doing with my life? Why do I have all this stuff out here? Let's put that in there. Let's, um, I don't think we're going to have any more weddings here for a while. So let's put this stuff up in the attic. We're going to put it up in the, up in storage up here. Cause I feel like that's what these people would do, right? They would put their stuff in the, I, I don't know. Let's just sell it. Who gives a crap? I don't want to store it. I don't want to store it. Sometimes I like to do that for my Sims because I feel like it's much more realistic that people store things um, when they're no longer using them than just sell them. But I don't know. I don't care. Then, I, then you have to deal with the crap and it's easier just to get rid of it. So that's what we're doing. That's what we're doing now. That's where we are. And we could put the hot tub on the roof. That's true. Will it fit up there? I don't know if it'll fit up there. I don't know. That looks kind of tight. I'm going to put it back here. Let's see. Got to get that hot tub. Ooh, should we get the... Oh, no, that's 20,000 simoleons. I don't want to get the love tub. We're going to get a regular old hot tub. We're just going to put it out here. Right here. Maybe I'll put some concrete around it. I can make like a little path over here. There we go. That's that's all right. That's all right. We can do that. Now Don has his hot tub. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Now Don has his hot tub. <laughs> the Sims 2 is great, Fez. It's the best. All right, so that's good enough. That's good enough for for now. We need I need to do some more to the yard, but that's okay. Um now Don, oh now he wants to woohoo in the hot tub. Okay, perfect timing. Let's get the kids put to bed and then Cassandra and Dawn can go woohoo in the new hot tub. Maybe she'll get Gregante. <laughs> He's totally going to get in the hot tub with some random lady. He totally is, Fernanda. I know he is. <laughs> We don't have any, uh, well, I think you missed Tasha and Alexander's baby. I don't know how long you haven't been here. Simitone? The heck is that? Yeah, roofs is the only thing that's hard. <laughs> I'm a lot better at roofs than I used to be. Um, yeah, Alex and Tasha Go had a little baby boy named Vance. Vance Goth. <laughs> okay and now cassandra wants to have a baby we did have her on birth control but now she's off uh dawn just bathed kiara so we're gonna go put her into bed and then dawn and cassandra are gonna go outside and break in the new dawn's new hot tub <laughs> you hope the random lady is sandy broody me too me too Um, no, I haven't ever tried that before, Nick. No, I haven't. I haven't. I play Sims 1 fine on my system, though, and I didn't need anything extra. Although, I did it. I installed it on this computer, like, over a year ago, so I don't remember exactly what I did. But it works great for me. But I am going to be getting a new computer in December, so I'm going to have to try and reinstall everything. And I am not looking forward to it, guys. I just hope and pray that The Sims 2 is going to work for me. Okay, so let's go out to the hot tub. Oh, it's back here. It's back here. I know, those friends calling late at night for 10 hours. Oh, I can't just click on it to woohoo? All right, Cassandra's gonna answer the phone and then we'll hang up on whoever called. That way we don't have to listen to the phone ring the whole time. Oh, it adds fully 3D view. Ooh, maybe I'll have to check that out. I want a Sandy baby. I hardly ever use the aspiration rewards in The Sims 2. The only one I really use are is the smart milk. 
It's Mary Sue. Okay, we gotta go, Mary Sue. We got we got business to take care of here. And in The Sims 3, I use them um I use them more. I like to always let my Sims save up 20,000 points and then I get the uh, best friend, whatever it is, for best friend forever or whatever. Can't remember what it's called. It's something about friendship. And uh, that way my friendships never decay in The Sims 3 because I find that annoying. <laughs> That's the one I use the most there. Okay, so then we're going to do a casual woohoo in the hot tub. Or should we try for baby? Should we try for baby? I mean, she does want a baby. I think we should try for baby. We're gonna go to casual. Oh, we can't do try for baby. Okay, we just have to get in. We just have to both get in the hot tub. Um, Let's see, join. Oh, he's already getting in. He was already getting in without my input at all. He wants to woohoo in the hot tub. She wants to try for baby. Um, We're gonna do it. You kept the SSD you were already using before. That's a good idea, Marie. That is a good idea. But I need more space on my SSD. I need more I need more space on my hard drive too. So, I'm I'm replacing everything. Okay, get in here, Dawn. Get in! No, get in! Oh my god, are we gonna play musical hot tub here? Get in! What is happening? Get in! What? Why are they both freaking out like they saw somebody naked? Join. I know, it's so annoying. Oh, it, it might have been ghost. It might have been ghost. Yeah, I know I can add another one, but I don't want to. <laughs> I just want, I don't want to add another one. I want to replace them. Um, let's see. Let's try for baby. Or we have to, no, we have to cuddle. We have to cuddle first. We have to do this all the old fashioned way. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, it's so annoying. The, I have the hardest time with hot tubs. I don't usually have it with beds, but they do this all the time with hot tubs. Yep. The ghosts are watching. The ghosts are watching for real. Okay, let's try for baby. Try for Babby. Okay, let's we're gonna watch the ghosts. We're gonna watch the ghosts over here. Oh, never mind. Wait, why are we getting a cutscene? They have definitely woohooed before. They have twins. Long, long <laughs> Yeah, it's their first woohoo in the hot tub. And I'm pretty sure I have some kind of setting somewhere where I get cut scenes for the first time in the hot tub every time. No, they were not messing around. They got it done. They tried for baby and now Cassandra's exhausted now. She's gotta go to bed. Sorry, Dawn. Sorry to, to uh, I don't know. I can't think of a good rhyming analogy for that, but she's going to bed now. <laughs> like the very first time. <laughs> when the hot tub music plays twice. I didn't even notice that. Cassandra's pervy ghost ancestors watching everything go down. Okay, oh, who's in there crying? You can, okay, Oscar. Oh, he's gotta go to the potty. Okay, hold on, Cassandra. Potty train this child first. And then you can go to bed. Cause I wanna fulfill this want for her. Okay, here she goes. Even though he can no longer, we made smart milk for him and then he wouldn't go potty. I don't, I like my, I like getting the cutscenes for everything. So I keep them turned on. I, I'm like, give me every cutscene. I don't care how many times. I never get tired of seeing it. Sleep is for the weak. You can sleep when you're dead. <laughs> you can't sleep. You're a mother. <laughs> That's why I'm never going to become a mother. <laughs> I need my sleep too badly. <laughs> yep. 
Yeah, I guess I can see that, Shadowfire. <laughs> okay, good. He still didn't get freaking potty trains. I mean, how much is it going to take, kid? How much is it going to take? Okay, Cassandra's got to go to bed. If she is prego, we're going to lose the baby at this rate. Um, Don. Don's still out here in the hot tub. He didn't care. He's like, yeah, you go ahead and go to bed. I'm going to hang out down here. Wait for Sandy Broody to walk by. Um, this kid's all right, but I'm gonna have Dawn come and potty train her. Dawn seems to, like, really, uh, be close to Kiara. He's, he likes her a little bit more. He's got a 68 relationship with Kiara, 58 with Oscar. Oh my god, Dawn now has three bolts with Dina and only two with Nina. I have never seen that before. It's usually always three bolts with Nina and two with Dina. Now it's the opposite. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah he does play favorites with his kids he does he does it in all my games i don't know if babby's formed yet or not okay don get out of the hot tub what's wrong with you you're gonna spontaneously combust down there i don't know we don't know if babby's formed yet we'll have to watch cassandra she's asleep right now she uh she was really really tired after their woohoo so i just had to send her to bed oops and now dawn is playing with the oh my god i'm gonna yawn seriously seriously i'm gonna yawn i'm so sorry it's so entertaining to watch me yawn on stream those dirty stinky bottles no i don't think you can combust in hot tubs i don't think inside the hot tub you can I don't know. I've never had a combustion in, in my Sims 2 game before. I have had it in Sims 3, though. Oh, good for you, Oscar. Learning the skill that nobody cares if you learn. Okay, the babies are fine. Um, let's take care of Dawn. Dawn really needs to stay up as late as possible because he works till 1 a.m. Well, it's 4.19 a.m., so I guess I can send him to bed, too. Yes, you're boring me, Adam. God, you're making me yawn. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> no, I don't know what's wrong with me. Um, Laszlo decided that he was going to pounce repeatedly on my legs this morning at like six o'clock. Yeah, he's like completely recovered from his surgery and he's a bat out of hell again. I was like, I thought he was going to be all calm after he got fixed. Nope, he's still a kitten. <laughs> Your chickens would combust in the summer? Oh my god, that's hilarious, Joe. <laughs> he looks like a Cheeto. <laughs> Cheeto baby. That's Kiara. She's a little Cheeto. I'm a little Cheeto, short and stout. Here is my cheese dust. Here is my snout. <laughs> I'm sorry. I apologize for that. <laughs> Your cat's nearly two years old and <laughs> she still acts like a kitten. <laughs> yeah, my cat is very active. He's very active. He loves the bathroom. He likes to sleep in the sink, in the bathroom sink, which is so gross to me. I'm like, I brush my teeth in that. You have three kittens. Are you insane? Are you insane? That sounds crazy. Okay, I don't know what I'm doing with this kid. Everybody's asleep, child. Uh, maybe we should wake up Cassandra. She needs to use the bathroom anyway, and she can give this kid some attention. Maybe give him a... Maybe take him to the bathroom. I don't know. Your cat like to sleep with your dog? Aww. Aww, thanks, Enzo. <laughs> you have to take her to use the litter box every night. Aww. Aw, Stray had kittens on your porch. Oh my goodness. Let's potty train Oscar. One cat is enough for me for like the rest of my life. I'm I'm done. Lazlo is it for me. They're wild and yeah, six months. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Lazlo's like nine or ten months now, I think. I think. God, I don't know how old he is. 
He's not fully grown, but he's not like a little baby anymore. I like playing with them too. I just want them to stop whenever I'm ready to stop and they don't. <laughs> oh my gosh, neighborhood cats kept coming in the cat door. 13 cats! Oh no, no, <laughs> no, no. I, my dogs are like way more well behaved than my cat. But that's just because he's a cat, you know? He's just a troublemaker. He's just a little mischief maker. <laughs> but I adore him. How long is it gonna take you to get potty trained, kid? I'm getting real mad at you. Um, let's get this kid a bottle. I'm not even paying attention to this one. And then does she have to go to work? We gotta go get some breakfast. I don't even know. The food went bad again. Ugh. I wish the butler would put away the leftovers. I hated that they just leave it out. Kiara's drinking chunky milk. Well, that's what she gets. <laughs> um, are you talking about what we do in the shadows? Because that is... We named Laszlo after uh, that Laszlo and also the Sims Laszlo. Yep. Love that show. Can't wait for the next season. <laughs> Give that guest a chunky slice. Hot drinks really get you going. <laughs> I love what we do in the shadows too. It's the best. It is so good. It is so good. I don't know what he's making. He's making pancakes. He's making blueberry pancakes. Yeah, well, I don't know. I don't know about these kids. Really get you going. Warms you up when you feel you're slowing. When these we always serve it right away. Got it. <laughs> I got the words. I got the third line down. All right. <laughs> yeah, I see it. <laughs> I don't care. I'm just letting everything burn in this house whatever okay cassandra's going to work now though and let's check on the babies once again i don't know Ugh. sometimes i just when i have twins i just i just look at them and i just go Ugh. <laughs> i don't even want to take care of you babies i don't even care just just hurry up and grow up already <laughs> I'm just like, I don't even know where to even begin. I don't even, I don't even know. Let the butler, let the burbler take care of him. <laughs> let the burbler take care of Dwight Schrute. <laughs> oh my God, no, Joe. I don't know how you do those triplets. I don't know how you do that. The smart milk's still good. Somebody drink it. No, it won't let me, it won't let him drink it. I tried to click on it. No actions are available. No actions are available. No actions are available. Yes, I know you're sleepy. Don, where? What are you doing? Down there eating a rotten hamburger? Oh, he's gonna clean it up. I just want to do a stream one time where we just don't control the Sims at all. We just don't do anything and just watch what they do. Do you guys think that would be fun? I just want to do that. I mean, maybe not a household that I care about. Maybe just like a test household. <laughs> I don't want to let, I don't want my, uh, households to just, you know, combust. <laughs> yes, you do want to. Okay. <laughs> we'll do it. We'll do it. Sim survivor. I love it. Oh, no. See, that's kind of what we were doing with the asylum and then things got really bad. But see, I wouldn't do it with the asylum rules. I would do it like in a fully furnished house with food and stuff. You know what I'm saying? Do it with the oldies. <laughs> no, I will never play the Asylum Challenge again. I hate it. I hate it so much. I hate it so bad. <laughs> no pianos. All they're going to do is play the piano. Okay, so the babies are... What are the babies doing? I thought they were going to bed. Okay, that one is. All right, Burbler, put that baby to bed. How come you're not cleaning up these bottles? 
All right, we're going to have to call a maid. You know how the butler always says, I can handle all the duties of the maid and the gardener. Like, no, you can't, buddy. No, you can't. You say that and look at my house. Why are you, where are you going? Clean that up. He's cleaning it up now. The front, you left one of your household, you left one of your elder households running when you came back. The house was on fire, the wife was dead, and the husband was inside on the computer without a care in the world. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, at least he's cleaning it up now. Jeez. There's like 15 rotten bottles on the floor. Man, we never even finished the oldies last round. I think I'm just going, going to go in there and cheat them forward. <laughs> We do have Herb. Herb has his baby, so at least that was fun. Herb has his baby with Melissa Fancy. And I wouldn't mind him making another, like, Sandy Broody baby. Yeah, they have the same face template. This is, he's like a John Burb clone. The Burbler. Burbler. He'll burble you back to hell. <laughs> Man, I'm so sad I can't show Tim and Eric on the stream anymore. Cause it gets caught it gets the copyright. Yeah, I remember seeing a funeral mod. But I never tried it. It doesn't work anymore. Oh yeah, we're all babbies all the time in this chat. Sandy Broody Babby. <laughs> I want a Sandy Broody Babby. <laughs> Okay, so Don, what are you up to now? Oh, still playing the piano, of course. Um, let's see. Hey, Don wants to go on a date, though, y'all. We still have 30 minutes, right? We still have 30 minutes. Who can he go on a date with? Okay, he's been out with Nina, Dina, Cassandra, Kaylin. Does he have nobody left? Not Lilith! He has two bolts with Lilith. Oh my god, no. He has nobody. Okay, let's send him out on the town, Don. Do you have to go to work today? No, he's off today. It's perfect. It's perfect. Okay, so he's got, do they have a car? Yeah, he's going to take the car. They're going to go. So he's going to go somewhere. He's going to leave the babbies with the burbler. It was satisfying watching him clean up those bottles. I agree with that. Let's go down to Doc Allen's and see what's up. See who's down there. See who's down at Doc Allen's. We haven't had Don do any of his scumming around lately. Yeah, I've had I've had a funeral in The Sims 3, but not in The Sims 2. I'm going to I'm going to try to in Edgewood I will try to like simulate a funeral. Maybe I'll do it in Pleasant View too, I don't know. A full family and bring up all the children while almost always playing in Speed 3. Oh lord. I can't, I'm like a perpetual pauser. I don't think I could ever make myself stop pausing all the time. <laughs> They never clean the hot tub water at Doc Allen's. It's always a, a people stew. A sim stew. <laughs> and Don brings the special sauce. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, podium. Yeah, that's what I would probably do, Joe. That's what I've been thinking about doing. That's what I'm going to do for my church. Who is that? Kennedy Cox. Kennedy Cox, the big old jerk. <laughs> <laughs> Just to add chlorine. <laughs> okay, Thomas Lewis is here. It's, oh no, it's, oh, that's Brittany, oldie. Brittany, you're a teenager. I don't think teens are supposed to be here. Didn't we ban teens? I swear we banned teens from here. Uh, Maybe we didn't. Maybe we didn't. Age? No, we didn't. Ban teens. Maybe I had a reason for that. I don't know. Ban children. But I'm banning them now. I want adults here. Um, delete adjuster. Many babbies will be formed at Doc Allen's. You got that right. Okay, here's Brandy Letourneau. Why don't you go meet her? Let's see. Greet Brandy. He wants to go on a date, but there's nobody for him to go on a date with, so he's got to start meeting people. It's just, it's just a bunch of dudes in here. All right, Brandy's here, and then... Oh, there's another dude. Brandy's all you've got, Dawn. She's all you've got. 
let's see here. Oh, one bolt. That sucks. Maybe he can go to the pool and get ripped. Oh, yeah. his ho It wasn't his hobby swimming. Hold on. Let me see. I think his hobby is swimming. Maybe. Oh, it's snowing out here. That's great. Yeah, his hobby is swimming. I forgot about that. Okay, let's go to the pool. Let's go to the pool and start working on getting ripped. Maybe Don's getting curious. Maybe he is. Look at all these dudes in here. <laughs> That'd be a nightmare if you were a woman to go there. Okay, uh, drive to another lot. You just walk in, there's nothing but a bunch of dudes standing around. Get ripped. <laughs> it's so weird to hear my voice. <laughs> okay, um, we're going to the pool. I need to change the name of that. Oh, great. Here comes Marilena Hamilton. Well, too late. Don's already on his way out, Marilena. It's winter, but he doesn't care. That's not going to stop him. You had Don consult the matchmaker. He was accidentally paired with teenage Angela Pleasant. Oh, no. Yes, I would end the date immediately, too. <laughs> I have adult teen and teen. And, I have adult teen interactions enabled. I don't know why I do, though, because I never I never use it. I never let my Sims get involved with teenagers, but for some reason, I have it. I think the reason why I have it is because, like, if you have one Sim who ages up on their round, and they're, like, you have two teens who are dating, and then you play one household, and the and the teen ages up to a young adult, but the other Sim is still a teen, so they can still keep seeing each other. Because then it's just, like, the difference between 17 and 18, you know? But other, that's really the only situation that I allow them to be involved. Oh my god, there's Lucy. <laughs> there's Ivy Cooper. Let's go uh, meet, greet her. Yeah, I think I have the one that keeps them going steady too, but I don't like that they can't flirt. Hey, Lai. Okay, did he greet her? All right, I don't. Oh, she's gay. That's right. I think she's gay. Oh, Don's gotta go to Don's gotta go to the potty. I started to say the potty. He's gonna go potty. <laughs> yeah, I don't do like a sim who just turned thirteen and a forty-year-old man. Like I don't do that. <laughs> I don't allow that to happen. But it's only like, like I said, I only use it if I have two sims who are dating and one ages up first. He likes Ivy. He's talking to her about love, and she's going to be like, no, sorry. You're barking up the wrong tree over here, bud. <laughs> I don't know what this music is, but I'm jamming out to it. Okay, let's go meet somebody else. Look, um, Andrea Hogan is here. She's usually down for a fling. Let's greet Andrea. Oh, hello. Uh, whatever your name is. Randy London. Oh, Christy Stratton is also here. I don't think Christy Stratton would be into him, but we'll see. Did he agree? Oh, he, he fears having a baby now. Nope, he has no chemistry with Andrea. All right. I am not even going to have him talk to Lucy. I don't even want to know. I don't even want to know what if he has chemistry with Lucy or Angela. Um, I guess we could try Christy. Let's just see. Will I woo you? Oh, no. Christy's gay. So Christy's gay and Ivy Cooper is gay and nobody else here likes him. <laughs> we do need more age ranges. I agree. Yeah, she's she is DTF. <laughs> I can't say what that stands for, Joe. It stands for down to down to have some woohoo. That's what it stands for. <laughs> yeah, DT dub. <laughs> <laughs> yeah down to freaky town <laughs> i like that one fist penguin don is just like really trying to impress ivy i think he's one of those guys he's he's definitely one of those guys who thinks that women are just gay because they haven't slept with him yet you know what i mean you know those kind of guys that's don <laughs> 
<laughs> he just keeps trying to get with Ivy, and she's like, no, thank you. Oh, my God, who was Ivy just farting hearts over? I hope it was Andrea. Yeah, he doesn't take no very well. <laughs> Down to find your pelvis. <laughs> you mean straight guys? Well, not all straight guys are like that. Not all straight guys are like that. Just a certain subset. <laughs> Yeah, Ivy is gay. I'm like 100% sure she is. Um, I, we can find out if I do Will I Woohoo. Yep. Ivy is gay and uh, Andrea is gay. Maybe they could be a couple. But I'm not coupling them up. I'm saving them for if we have our gay, our gay sim, playable sims. Oh, no, he's talking to Angela. Oh, yeah, Lucy's out here trying to save souls. He's got two bolts with Angela Dawn. No, Dawn, stay away. <laughs> yeah, those are the worst kind of guys. I agree with that. <laughs> I like Andrea and Ivy too, but because they're both townies, unless we like see them get together on their own, then there's we'll probably end up like pairing one of them up with one of our playable gay female sims that doesn't have a partner but we'll see hello christy so did he have is she gay do we just have like a whole bunch of gay female sims in this in edgewood all of our males are gay and in pleasant view all of our females are gay it's like we need some straight people okay let's see cat god dawn it wasn't that funny. Oh my god, Christy Stratton is also gay. Christy, Andrea, and Ivy are all three gay? How is that possible? <laughs> they are. It's lesbian town. I love it. <laughs> all right. Well, at least we know. At least we know. Yeah, I checked Andrea, too. Yeah. Yep, yep. It's so weird because it's like the opposite of what happened in Edgewood. In Edgewood, all of our guys ended up gay and none of our women. And now we have the opposite problem <laughs> in Pleasant View. Yeah, it's a popular lesbian cruising spot. Yep. Okay, so I guess Don better go somewhere else because he's not going to have any luck here. I mean, he's talking to Angela, but she's already taken. And I don't see anybody else here. Okay, Dawn, let's let's ha let's stop back. Let's go stop by the grocery store. You can do something good for your family, get some groceries, and see if anybody shows up over there. He's not having any luck, y'all. I'm sorry. Let's drive to another lot. Um, I I think Jan Tellerman is straight. I'm pretty sure Jan Tellerman is straight. Let's go to the grocery store here. Maybe we'll run into her. Because I'm pretty sure she has chemistry with uh, Herb Oldie. So I think Jan and Sandy are both straight. And then we know... Um, who else? Who else? Who did we send to college before that I made a townie? I can't remember. Oh, Brandy Laterno is straight. She just doesn't have very much chemistry with, with Dawn. But yeah, we've got we've got a lot of straight women too. It's just weird that like all the three uh, lesbian women were at the pool at once. <laughs> and Dawn was trying to find a straight lady. The AI social townies? Oh, apartment life. No, no, no. I don't have the apartment life townies, Joe, no. Yeah, I know you can buy groceries. That's weird. It was gay day at the pool. Yeah, <laughs> I should have checked the guys too while we were there. Okay, John, uh, Don's gonna s finish his day. That's that Stephen Washington that I have no idea who that is. He's gonna finish his day at the grocery store getting some groceries for the family. Let's go buy and we'll see if anybody comes. Bo Broke is here. I'm gonna zoom out so I can see who's coming up. Abjit. Abajit. I don't know. I say it however I say it. I'm sorry. I don't think Sandy's bi. I don't think so. She might be, but I thought she was straight. 
Um, okay, let's just fill her up. Get 600 simoleons worth. Oh, there's Meadow Thayer. Meadow Thayer is gay, too, by the way. Meadow Thayer is going to get with Brittany Oldie. Um, we don't have any waitresses because I don't have any restaurants in Pleasant View. Who, man, it's a, oh, there's Mary Sue. He'll probably have, he'll probably have chemistry with Mary Sue, but that's not going to happen. Oh, who's this? Oh, Marilena. Okay, Marilena Hamilton. I think she's straight too. Let's see. Yes, she is straight. Let's go talk to her. I can't remember what the scores are for the bolts, for the different bolts. Thank you so much for the follow, cool kid. Oh, sorry, Dawn. Were you trying to go to the bathroom? Did you buy the groceries yet? I wasn't paying attention to you. I was just looking at what Sims were coming up. <laughs> yeah, she probably will not like him, but we're going to try anyway. Oh, she just kept on walking. She was like, no, thank you. I'm not interested, sir. I'm not interested in what you're selling. <laughs> I'm trying to go get my groceries. <laughs> She's just totally ignoring him. She just kept on going. Nope. That's the second time she's ignored him. Go try to greet her again. She's going to think you're stalking her. He just needs someone to find his pelvis. <laughs> yeah, his only requirement. Are you straight? Are you a female? That's all he cares about. Okay, let's see. Oh, no, they have negative chemistry. Man, he's not having any luck. This is so weird. Um, yeah, he's not having any luck with her. Now, I mean, I could still send him on dates with people that he has negative chemistry or one bolt with if I wanted to, but I like trying to find somebody that he actually likes. <laughs> His turn-ons are um, jewelry and fitness, so it's not even, like, that crazy. I guess we could throw slap some jewelry on some of these ladies because I don't think any of the townies wear jewelry. <laughs> oh, I like her dress too. That is cute. Marilena, you looking cute, honey. Okay, well, I think I'm just gonna send him home. It's I don't think it's gonna happen for him today. Brittany Oldie, she's too young for you. Usually right about the time I send them home, I'll see like Sandy Broody sauntering by. Sandy Broody would be perfect. Because I know he's going to have chemistry with her. I know he is. He got the groceries already. They're in his inventory here. So let's see. He has, he only has one bolt with uh, Brandy Letourneau. He has two bolts with both Angela and Lilith because I think he secretly likes a redhead. But that's weird. They're taken and they're yo much younger than him, although they are adults now. <sighs> yep, just didn't work out. I know those are prime Sandy Broody hours. <laughs> she didn't show up. <laughs> yeah, in The Sims 4 where all the townies wear jewelry. And in The Sims 3, my dresser, the dresser mod, gives all of the townies incredibly stupid jewelry, too. <laughs> or he likes twins. Oh, my God. That's probably it. That's probably it, Martian Mermaid. He probably likes twins. He likes Dina, Nina, Angela, and Lilith. He's got a thing. He's got a thing going on. Thank you. Oh, the gardener. Why doesn't he talk to the gardener? Oh, she, he's not going to be home in time. Dang it. I should have had him talk to the gardener. There goes Brandy. There goes Angela. Okay, let's speed through this. <laughs> you want a ring? How about six? Maybe five bracelets too. Yes. <laughs> yes, Leah. That's how it. That's how it works. Don sent two hundred to Regina Caliente for support. Oscar learned a skill point. Cassandra's home from work now. All right, Cassandra's home. She earned two hundred and twenty simoleons today. She is exhausted. We don't know. She could possibly be prego, but we don't know for sure. Man, this stupid butler letting all the food go to waste. <laughs> Good thing Dawn's bringing home some groceries. Now, let's see. Who needs to be potty trained? Oscar and this... Oh, he just got potty trained by the stupid burbler. Oh, man. Cassandra wanted to potty train him, not you. 
You're raising her children. Okay, well, I better unlock that. He just got potty trained. At least he learned the skill, though. At least he learned it. And Cassandra, like I said, she's really tired, so let's have her go to go to bed. Go sleep in pajamas. The burglar burglars her burglars her aspir <laughs> burgles her aspiration. <laughs> Useless burglar. I mean he's useful, but I mean that in a very like jealous way. <laughs> like now Cassandra has to watch the burglar raise her children because she's too busy and she's jealous. The kids are gonna love burglar more than they love her. Useful in the wrong in all the wrong ways. Okay, so she's going to sleep. I think the kids are all right. This one needs to go to sleep, but we'll let the burglar handle it. <laughs> Memory. Learn to use potty from the burglar. <laughs> I know he's doing a great job, isn't he, Mary? He's doing a great job, and we're like, we hate you. <laughs> he's taking really good care of the kids. I mean, he totally is. I, I have to admit it. Oh, Cassandra just woke up. Why'd you just wake up out of nowhere? Are you get are you pregnant? Are you pregante? Why are you waking up? Okay, that's cool, I guess. Um, go to the bathroom. And let's see if the kids need anything that you can help with this time. Yeah, I think you could put this one nope, he's already got her. Never mind. Burbler Burbler's already done it, Cassandra. Did someone ring the bell? I didn't hear it. Let me see. Uh, oh, Brandy and Darren are out here. Were they coming over to visit? Yeah, yeah, they were. Brandy and Darren came over. Okay, let's greet them. Hey, guys. Um, thanks for stopping by, I guess. <laughs> um, that's kind of a weird. Oh, it's because of Darren. It's because Darren is, Darren's like, hey, I just want to bring my new wife over here. Wow, Cassandra has two bolts with Orlando. <laughs> Hello, thank you, Burbler. D oh, Darren's all pissed off at Coral now. Because remember, Darren and Coral had a little affair. You guys remember that? Yeah, the toddlers are going to age up in one day. Which I don't think we'll have time to see today, but we'll see it next week. Okay, well, I hope uh, Darren and Cassandra don't, like, flirt or anything in front of Brandy. Darren's already been having an affair with Coral Oldie, which is beyond weird. <laughs> yeah, I forgot about Darren and, and Coral, too, until I just saw him fuming over it. Yeah, women love Orlando. Oh, gosh. Okay. I hope that was a friendly kiss there. Oh, no. Oh, heavens no. Cassandra just freaking fell in love with Darren. Cassandra, what are you doing? No, Brandy is right there. Okay, tell inside joke. We gotta watch these two. I'm just waiting on them to go woohoo in front of Brandy or something. Oh, I gotta save game. Okay, let me do that. God. I know Darren's living Dawn's dream. Darren's got no shortage of ladies, right? Dawn's out there trolling the town. Can't find anybody to take him up on his offer. No, stop it, you guys. Brandy's right there. What are you doing? If you break Brandy's heart, I'm going to break your face. <laughs> don't, don't you dare do that to Brandy, Darren. <laughs> The burglar could have stopped it. I think he does have a fetish for married women. Melon, I think he does. Man, I tell you, there's something wrong. There's something wrong in here. Okay, Cassandra's going to take a bath. Burglar's taking care of the kids. I mean, he's actually a really good nanny. Like, I think he's the best butler I've ever had. <laughs> in any of my games, I think the burglar is the best. She's washing away her sins. <laughs> Don's rubbing off on Darren. Yeah, Don's losing his touch. And Darren's getting his touch. Is. <laughs> yeah, he likes married moms. Married older women. Um, Cassandra's got, she's going to be an elder in 15 days. I really hope that we can give her one more baby before she becomes an elder. And I really hope she doesn't die on us. Okay, what are these two doing? They just came over to use the hot tub. 
Darren just came over to flirt with Cassandra and use the hot tub. Why are you freaking out, Brandy? That's, first of all, that's your husband. And second of all, he's not even nude. <laughs> okay, burglar's leaving. Your cat's sitting on your foot. <laughs> no, she can't get in the hot tub because she's prego. Cassandra's like, I'm just going to play a little chess. I'm just going to listen to some music, pace, play some chess. Just fell in love with her best friend. Brandy, stop doing that. What is that? Why is she doing that? And third, this isn't even your house. Look at her. Third, this isn't even your house. Exactly right. Cassandra's going to have a baby with Darren. I was already thinking that. That, that thought had already crossed my mind. Maybe his swimwear is incorrectly tagged as nude. Oh, that could be it. That could be it. She thinks he's naked. Yeah. Brandy's been pregnant for like four years. <laughs> She's ready to pop. What's your problem, Darren? You thinking about yourself? I know you are. You're only thinking about yourself. You're not thinking... Oh. Oh. Did he just get up upset because he saw himself naked? <laughs> Is it the ghost? But he keeps thinking of himself. Um. I th um. <laughs> there's not even any ghosts over here. <laughs> He's just screaming. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. What was that? <laughs> oh my god. Aw, <laughs> thanks, Kayla. <laughs> I don't know what that was. I don't know what just happened. Now Cassandra's in here playing chess with Brandy. She's trying to make Brandy feel like there's nothing going on here. <laughs> they, they got issues. I don't know. I feel like something's going on with that hot tub back there, though. Something's going on. Let me check in, check in on the babies. Oh, Darren's... Darren, what are you doing with my baby? Darren, put my baby down. Okay, which one is this? Is this Cheeto? Kiara. Kiara is Cheetos. Okay, we're gonna have her go up here and potty train Kiara. Maybe we can get her to teach her her potty skill. Darren, put my baby down. What are you doing? You can't just take, what? No. Okay, Dawn's home. Dawn brought the groceries home. Dawn, put these groceries up. He stinks too. Okay, thanks for bringing the baby all the way downstairs, Darren. And now I've got to bring her all the way back up. Thanks a lot. There was a freaking fridge upstairs. <sighs> I think he has been smelling too much turpentine. <laughs> She's a Cheeto. Okay, so what are you doing, Dawn? I, I don't know what's happening anymore. Somebody potty trained this child. Thank you, Darren, I guess, for trying to help. But now we have to bring her all the way back. Oops. All the way back upstairs. He is not going to cook the baby on the barbecue. I would never use that mod. I hate that mod. That barbecue baby mod, I hate that. Oh, thanks, Jillian. <laughs> That's how you come over for a dip and steal a baby on your way out, Leah. <laughs> It's awful, isn't it? I'm glad I'm not the only one who thinks so. Uh, thank you for the follow walls. Oh, we got a meme three minutes ago. I'm sorry, I missed your meme. We're gonna, we'll do a meme here. Yeah, I think it's just shock value. It definitely is, but people use it. I saw, I saw a YouTube video the other day where somebody was using it on a YouTube video. And I was like, ah. Oh. I, I know, I can't stand it. Like, I don't know why you'd want that in your game. I don't know why you'd want to do that in your game, but whatever. Aw, thanks, APK. Shout out to, to Cindy for all of her Sims 2, 3, and 4 content on YouTube. Aw, thanks. I appreciate that. I'm glad you appreciate the variety. <laughs> I, would, I wouldn't even try it. I wouldn't even try that mod. Oh, look, she did get to potty train one of them. She got to potty train Kiara. I'm happy. Even though she didn't want to anymore, she still did. She wants to play with a relative. Let's have her play with Kiara. Uh, 
plate tickle. Oh, thanks, Joe. Um, you think that might be what the problem is? Let's see. Let's see. Deletes the haunted emitters, which cause seems to seems to freak out at random objects. That must be what's going on then. Let's see. Nuke. Ghost emitter. Let's try that. Okay, fixture removed one object. Hopefully that, that will fix that. Thanks, Joe. Okay. Um, so Cassandra's gonna go to sleep now. And we're gonna watch a meme to end the stream with. Watch a meme. We're gonna look at a meme. We're gonna look at a meme. Bye, Brandy. Thanks for stopping by. And Dawn, what are you doing? Tossing the kid in the air? Okay, whatever. I don't care. <laughs> so next week when we play... Uh, this family, the kids will be aging up and hopefully we can get Cassandra Pregante for the last time, or at least one more time. <laughs> yes, Max, I know exactly what you're talking about. Those awful, I, I grilled my baby videos. Like, mm -mm, it's not cool. <laughs> I apologize. Apologies for ever mentioning it. I know it's your fault. You brought it up. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Okay, thank you for the follow, Nia. Okay, so let me save. Let's find a meme to go out on, y'all. Let's find a meme to ride out on. <laughs> okay, here we go. Let's see. What do we have? What do we have? What do we have? Doggy do game commercial. Doggy do game. Oh. I don't know what this is. It's the doggy do game. Oh, it's the doggy do game. I know you can't see it. I know you can't see it. I'm sorry. I couldn't pause. I couldn't pause. A meme to Oh, this is a commercial. What the heck? This is the second time I've done this. <laughs> Where I've told you guys, let's look at a meme and then I play a commercial. <laughs> well, let's watch it anyway. I'll give you a freebie. <laughs> We'll do, we'll, do, we'll do a freebie, y'all. Here we go. It's the doggy do game. <laughs> Let's play doggy do. Feed him, roll the die. What's that sound? Oh, no. Oh, no. Doggy did what doggies do. Doggy do. Bye what? Bye. Why? Why is that? <laughs> Why is that? Why is that a thing? I like how all the kids are like looking at the butt, just waiting on the turd to fall out useless useless i use that's about as useless as a toy i used to have when i was a kid called crocodile dentist anybody ever remember that game crocodile dentist crocodile dentist this is the stupidest thing you ever saw look crocodile dentist i wonder if there's a video yeah here it is here we're gonna watch this real quick if you've been hurt in a car wreck, stop. No, think. no, sorry, sorry. I don't want to make you watch an ad. Okay, here we go. Crocodile dentist, you had that too, Melon. No one ever likes going to the dentist, including crocodiles. <laughs> Hi, this is Jen from TTPM. It's okay, croc no, I just turns no, pressing that's down not, on the no, crocodile's teeth. No, one. That's not what I wanted to see. Okay, I wanted a real commercial. I don't want to, I want an unboxing. Anyway, you have to ch p pull the teeth out, and then if you get the wrong one, it snaps on your hand. Okay? <laughs> it's stupid. It's so stupid. It did hurt. It did hurt. You had a Shrek version? Oh, my God. It's dumb. It's dumb. Okay, let me find a meme. Let me find a meme. Oh, that commercial got an X on it, and I still watched it. Oops. <laughs> I think it was okay. Um, all right, so let's see. Where's our memes? Where's our memes? What kind of funny memes you guys got for me today? Oh, yeah, I love it. Oh, my God. It's my boys. It's my boys. It's my boys, Robin and Robin, y'all. <laughs> Name a more iconic duo. I'll wait. There is none. There is none. <laughs> Thank you, Beaky. <laughs> Those guys, man. <laughs> yeah, there's a bunch of memes. I'm just, I'm going to the most recent ones. When the Sims 2 music hits. <laughs> what is up with that derpy cat? Oh my God. 
Oh boy, those are hilarious. Okay, th spleen's the cat. What is that from? What's that from? You you guys all know what that is. I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. Oh, from Grace still plays. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I haven't ever seen that one. That is, that's unfortunate. That's an unfortunate cat. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, I'm going to go ahead and wrap up the stream here. So thank you so much for joining me. Let me see. What do we got going on this week? What do we got going on? Um, when's uh, Tomorrow is my first day in five days not to stream. So I'm taking a break tomorrow. But uh, I'll be back Wednesday night for more Sims 3 Pleasant View. So come join me for some more drama and chaos there. And then I've got a new video coming out for you guys tomorrow. And more stuff coming up later in the week. Thank you so much for the cheer, Nick. Thank you. And I will see you guys in the Discord. Don't forget to submit your spooky sims screenshot if you want a chance to win our halloween costume in the disc halloween costume halloween contest in the discord and if you are a new subscriber even if you're on a gift sub don't forget to join the discord server connect your twitch and your discord so you can get the bonus videos that i make for my twitch subs in there and also we have uh we have uh subscriber only channels in there so there's the discord server all right, guys, that's it. Have a great rest of your week, and I will see you on Wednesday night for some Sims 3. Bye.